Hey everyone, I'm back. Uh, my friend Josh joined me for this one to play some games of Visceral vs. Prism. We played five games. Uh, I hope you learned something from it. I hope you enjoy watching it. We had a ton of fun recording it. Um, it was it was a fun matchup. It was closer than either of us thought it would be. And yeah, let me know what matchups you'd like to see in the future. If you want to see me keep doing this, I have some friends of mine. I've asked them already to record a few matchups. I think that Guardian is probably one that people want to see. I would like to record some Guardian games, some Missouri games, maybe Kasai, maybe Katsu, Azalea. Let me know what you guys want to see next. Um, and yeah, I hope you enjoy the video. Peace out. Okay. I think it's usually right to throw one attack and just probe. Um, I think I'm just gonna do this. Mm. It's a little awkward, I guess, because it has go again. You can just play another one. Yeah, I mean that's that's what I'm hoping for because. I don't get to choose my arsenal here, but I leave damage, full cart, or full armor. Something like that. That's a pretty good turn zero. This is this is why I also enjoy going first, is because often you can throw two sevens. Yeah. Which just feels great. <clears throat> Oh, and you have a potter token too? That's really insane. Yeah. Uh... Take those. Dreamweavers. Over uh, Goliath yeah. Gauntlet. Interesting. We'll see, it's. Because I don't play reprimands, yeah. I need to turn my spell board down. Um, having the guaranteed, um, like no phantasm, mm -hmm. is really nice, especially after I ripped through armor. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I have a choice here. Yeah, my my turn one is not great. Yeah, I think I'm gonna capitalize on that. Or try to at the very least. Okay. Pitch you. Pitch you. Oh, you're on auras. Uh, I'm running exactly nine. Just Genesis is the yellow auras. Mm -hmm. And the blues are main board. Let's see. You tried it both ways, right? Like I know, you, I know you've played uh, against Jordan maybe. without arc lights before and stuff. Yeah, um, I don't love arc lights, so I have I have just Genesis as yellow auras. Really, you like the way my current sideboard is working? Wow, you uh, like that's... Genesis better than arc light? Yeah, the the reason being is that in a race, arc light is so awkward. Mm -hmm. Because what you want to be able to do is like stick a Soraya Archangel behind it. Mm -hmm. But the problem is, is that even when you, um, even when you just have to attack into ALS, I still have to deal with the rune chants that yeah. fight Soraya. Yeah. So it just, it has always felt awkward to me. Yeah. And I think this feels pretty good. Lucky I drew a yellow. Um, 
Oh, I'm actually pretty happy about this. Yeah, that balance is a card. Yeah, because my hand was a, a little awkward. I think it's going to be fixed by this balance draw. So here's the question. Do I throw six or five with an on hit? That's always the question. Mm. Um, I think here, let's see, so you've blocked with two. You have three armor block left. I don't know. I think... I think we'll throw the six just because you have grass. Okay, so still. you pitched a blue. Okay, I'm just gonna do this right now. Yeah. Six. Yeah, that's that is good. Wow. <laughs> that is really good. Yeah, I don't care about this. Spooky. This is just to see if I can get value out of Soraya, like the full four health. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, that actually makes a lot of sense, especially because I'm starting with two spectral shields. I mean, uh, two rune chants kind of works out. Yeah, um, I think as gonna go like against this. Jordan, I think I, I think I tried too often to protect the angels. Yeah, I mean, it's usually impossible. Uh, <laughs> Well, even like, and by protect, I mean save for the physical damage. Yeah, yeah, like block a spellblade strike for four or something. Mm, yeah. Let's see. So that's coming in for two rune chants and one. Mm -hmm. Do you have, you don't have, you don't have AB at all. Okay. Oh, that was a mistake, actually. Oh yeah, you're, do you have no iron gloves in the list? It's probably, I do have no iron gloves. It's gloves. <laughs> okay. Let's see, it's it's always it's just a race. super close on whether I actually want to deal with it or not. So. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like, and I think I often get baited into blocking or a being when I really shouldn't. So we'll see how it goes. Yeah, I, I mean, if we're just racing, it's not like a massive difference. You don't really want. Yeah. Don't really want it anyway. <laughs> I'm going up to six Four here. Chains. That's uh, yeah, that's a lot. And two action I mean, points. I basically, basically not having, not having null runes, lost me two life there, it, and that's it. Just like fine. Mm. Yeah, really Not insane turn. Personal. That is a lot of damage. A little bit. Yeah, well, we're just gonna we're just gonna click really fast. And six. I don't think I can block. I think. Yeah, I don't think it's right to. Yep. Come on, come on. You committed this hard. <laughs> <laughs> and you lose the enchant anyway, right? Is it purple? Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna brick. Well, oh, I do have Genesis. It's right okay. This, this is okay. Um. Do a Genesis. Put it there. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, you didn't kill Genesis, which is something. We'll see if it matters. Oh yeah, because now I just get the... I put a Herald. Yeah. Yep, so now I get the free flip regardless, which is This is... Huge. Um, I believe I, believe that. I don't care. That's fair. I'm just going to play this out. Yeah, yeah, I mean, like, obviously you forgot AB, but I like in this game, I don't think it's going to really make a difference. I mean, last turn, maybe you could have pitched, 
You would have had to pitch an entire card. I would, I would have pitched. I would have pitched exactly one, and then awakened an angel. Oh uh, yeah, okay. Um, with the float, which is which is fine. But so the you... thing is that I get the free flip on Empyrean because of Genesis anyway. Doesn't that not work? Because I actually get to filter my hand. Doesn't Genesis isn't Genesis at the start of your turn, and this is like during your turn? It doesn't. It doesn't trigger the fetch, but Empyrean Rapture's discounts of the hero ability is. If it's been put into my side, oh, any okay. Point. Okay, yeah. The yeah, the pretty, pretty the prism abilities during the action phase, yeah. I see. Mm -hmm. Yep. You got it. Um what do I get here? I think the answer is It's my graveyard. I think ravages. I might be wrong. And then I'll do this. Ooh. I don't normally get to play this, but by some miracle I had enough soul. Yeah, so. Genesis on the board. Mm -hmm. Now I'm just flipping pitch. They probably should flip swing there. one of these. Yeah. I think I think I'm going to flip Protection, so I have the Arcane on Ravages, if it ever comes to it. It isn't mm -hmm. entirely possible I'm just dead here, but there's there's always hope. Oh, I'm not starting with a Rune Chant, which actually really sucks. I'd have to sequence this turn differently. Oh, yeah, I have Special Shields, actually, so it doesn't matter. Never mind. It's a little bit awkward of a hand, but it's okay. Bell blade. So more, more creepers tricks. I'm expecting because he didn't block. I would never trick you. Or <laughs> let's see. So the go again on is revel. I don't have any tricks. Like I don't. <laughs> I'm not a tricky zero, guy. Or... They call me. I don't they, they call me face up Andy. They call me. They call me. I, I always ends his turn with an extra like card. Reckoning with a blue or something. I mean, I don't care. This just hits the angel. Yeah. 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 That's also fine. You only have the one AP. The only question is, how much does this do? So I'm going for um, four and seven four. right now, and then I'm making two on the back oh, end. Sorry, four and seven. So I'm actually not dead. <clears throat> pretty big. Yeah, actually, this is scary for yeah, me. The other reason, the other reason I really like Genesis is for the spectral shields. I think they're much more impactful than. Yeah, this this Genesis has been really good. I might just lose because of it. Yeah, I mean, I can help. It de <laughs> it depends on what my hand is. Yeah, uh, I'm just gonna let this hit. Uh, so at this point, I just have to keep. Uh, I just have to do like four okay oh, damage. I get, I get that I get Genesis too. Um, which is actually really awkward here, believe it or not. Hmm. I actually think I think I might skip this. In fact, I think skipping is definitely the right play here. Yeah, we'll press on that trigger. This guy has an angelic wrath for sure. Yep. Uh yep. I was gonna say is if I guess you can No you have ward, that's right. And Halo, so you don't just die to arcane damage. Um, I, mean, I guess I just make you play it, right? Yeah, you kind of have to. Well, my hand is kind of shitty. I think I might lose. 
it's possible. This is a lot of value for me. Yep, figment. We'll do my favorite trick and get triumph so I don't have to spend a halo on it. I think we do this. This does not have go again. Oh shoot, sorry. Sorry, yeah, forgot okay. it doesn't have to go. Yeah, again. yeah angel hurts. Ravages, yeah, it's just over now, I think. Which is, which is actually, let's see. Well, I mean, so, okay, if I keep, kind of cheeky. if I keep one That's card, not... you have to, like, break Halo for a single root chain or something. I'm actually considering breaking Halo now for soul. Mm. No, I can't do that, because then I don't have enough soul to do everything else, so I can't do that, unfortunately. <sighs> Yeah, not quite enough cards. Cause so I could do that. Throw it in soul. Yeah, there's no world in which that's worth it. I could oh, actually. I could do two. No, no way. Keep it simple, stupid. Um. We'll do ravages here. Sure. So you, do, yeah, the you don't have soul here? Okay. Is, yeah. Okay. That is um, the sad part. I mean, still, I just, like, I just die, basically. Yeah. Well, well this is going to die because I have rune chance. So I'm not going to die to arcane damage. No. Yeah, there is an argument for flipping triumph, but the problem is that I'd have to get two soul in somehow with only four cards in hand, which just doesn't happen very easily. And now we throw this. Problem is I have two two blocks also, so I can't cover this up with tunic. Yeah. Something blows. Um, okay, so this is spectral shield. Search doesn't really matter, but the soul matters. You have a genesis anyway, though. Oh, you have the resources to flip too? Holy shit. Uh, I've already flipped this turn. I flipped That's a once per turn. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's true. I do have Genesis. So if this hits, that that is an argument then to keep Ravages, then you're right. Because then I can always. Because this goes to Soul. Yeah, uh, I mean, I, I have to. Assuming, I have to assuming block. this hits. So, this is fucked up. You can't keep Ravages alive though if this goes to soul, right? Because you have ward and then spell void. I so could. The, yeah, the, well, the third rune chant. One more rune chant. Oh, this is a spectral yeah. shield. No. No, it's not. There's no spectrals. I don't have any shields. If the if the protection hits. Oh. Yes, if, right. if the protection hits, then you can cover up three rune chants, and I die to Ravages. Yeah. That's so. Yeah. That is. I, I have to block actually. That's so sad. So now I'm just. Yeah. It's just over. Yeah, cards like cards like the charge is also why I can't play. Um ALS. Yeah. Interesting. Um Angry Cycle. Did I? Angry Cycle. Oh no, never mind. Ooh. Actually kind of a hard choice. Um I think I do this one. Yeah, so I think we start off with this. With the Banish. Yep. Yeah. So um, you have to give me armor on this. Yeah, I'm just dead, I think. Like, uh, plus, Maybe. I just, I, I just added Ravages next turn after you take my whole hand. 
Yeah, taking your whole hand actually may not be possible here. I mean, that's really lucky if that happens. Yeah. No, I, I should have. Um, I think I definitely should have insulted a different card, but that's okay. Let's see. Though I can flip again. Actually, that, that does save things, I think. But nothing has gone to soul yet, which means I almost think. I almost think I halo here. I mean, if you take my whole hand, you just win next turn, so you might as well. Yeah. Yeah, because the problem is that I can only swing one more attack if I don't Halo. Yeah. So I think I have to pitch that. Mm -hmm. Choose that card. Oh, yeah. Yep, that was always the play, because now... You have Triumph with Go again into a Herald? Yeah, and I get war for a breakpoint. And Oof. I have free flip. Jeez. Um, so I didn't actually have to do that yet. But then we send this at a breakpoint as well. Yeah. Yep. And then the drawn card gives me the last, her last angel attack. Yeah, GG. Nice. Good game. Yeah, this time I get to go first. One. That's good. Um, I'm gonna try. I still don't think I still don't think Dreamweavers is the play, but it worked out okay because I got guaranteed action. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I think you should have AV one, um, but I agree. It was kind of fine, I obviously. I <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah I, I think Genesis is much better than. Else. Yeah, I, I wonder. Chance are so big. Yeah, I wonder if it's ever if it's worth me killing it at some point. Yeah, I mean the hard thing is that that costs you at least five damage. Yeah, yeah, you do it yeah. With your blade at the end. Which is like, so yeah, how many times I'm did you get Genesis off? That? Was it like four turn cycles or something? Um, I want to say. I want to say I got to click the button three times and I passed on it once. Yeah, that sounds right. So I got two rune chance out of it, which is two health. Mm -hmm. So I don't know. But the thing is that it also lets me just. You had soul on. and the flip. Gives me soul, lets me turn on mm -hmm. rapture, which is big sometimes. It depends. Oh, it's, it's did... like, it's oh. arguably big, because if, if you were to like block out or pop my first herald, then it's big. But if you're just no blocking the first herald, then it's much more than here. Mm -hmm. right. <clears throat> hmm. How much is that card compared to the other gems? Mm, I think it's about the same. It's like 300 bucks or something. Oh. Oh, that seems pretty good for you. Those are good cards. So you have a Revel and a Vexing. Huh. Um, do I just keep all of these? I kind of want another Rune Chant, though. This is... Hmm. Okay, I don't, I don't really want both of these blues, I'm not gonna lie. Do you get both of them? For each attack, get a... Oh, I see. Oh, no, I mean I mean from the tome. And and now the Spellblade. Mm. Um, it'd be stupid not to pitch. Uh, let's pitch this away. No spell void equipment, thank you. Can I just pass with this in my hand? I don't really want to do that. Wait, wait, Dreamweaver is, is 
spell void one. Oh, that's interesting. There is actually then an argument to run it. You can clearly tell that Dreamweavers is not there for the spell void. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Use it for one rune chant on turn zero. Yeah. I wanted to, I wanted to just sit on three rune chants, but I have to cycle these. I think. Which sucks. Yeah. So the thing is, is that you went down to zero action points, which means that I can resolve a Genesis here. Uh, I've already so because I because I have some reds, I can't do it. Mm -hmm. But if I had even one more yellow, I'd That's probably true. just take this and play the Genesis. So I probably just I probably um, just pass. Yeah, yeah. I think it's, it works out for you here, but I think generally that's the play. Yeah, that makes sense. I kind of walked into that one. And I, I did. I did have the Genesis. I just didn't have the resources for it. Um, mm -hmm. Okay, then coming in for two. Both uh, of these cards are so good. I didn't actually see any poppers. I mean, I guess this game did I? I, you know, you have red Arc Knights. Uh, yeah, I played one. At least. If you play Genesis, I do. I actually could make a Creepers play. Which oh, might be worth it. But, well, Cause I, have, you, I mean, you know, you know I have a level. So no, I could... Because then the, the Rune Chance would trigger... Oh, it's true, I didn't know that. Because then the Rune Chance would trigger and I wouldn't eat your Creepers. Yeah, I don't know. Well, if, I, if end I, with, I end with no Arsenal in that Genesis. case, though. Yeah, if I had three yellows and Genesis, I think that's fine. Oh, you take a lot I of damage. Still... Yeah. But I could still A, B the rune chance, and then your creeper is... Oh, no, because Revel, Revel makes four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, so I'm presenting three, five, yeah. nine arcane damage, and then it would be like, you know, six physical or something. Yeah, so it's like I forced your you, hand. If you play Genesis, you actually get like hard punished. I agree. Yeah, um, we're gonna block with the protection because I think on this turn cycle, the the other one is better. Yeah, I mean that was fine for you, for all that you did for that. Oh my goodness! How do I play this turn? Um, this is not awesome. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan myself. Let's see. <laughs> I think we definitely start with this. It could be it could be really big. It's not gonna be big. I missed the light of soul. That's that's a little annoying. Yeah, so it's like I think if I had if I was gonna get a herald or an angel out, I might have risked taking the popper on the protection instead. But I don't think actually it's a light. I could flip. No, because you have two rune chance. So I'd have to A, B, 1. My hand doesn't work. How much do I care about this? I'm just going to swing into their angel, probably. I mean, a uh, herald after this. Uh, minimum if this hits, I swing an angel, yeah. Yeah, if I block it, you might just swing another herald. This hand just kind of just doesn't really work. Every time I see the claim victory, it's like an automatic instinct to go click it. Like, no, <laughs> I can't. I was just like, throw a zero block equipment and then undo the block. I'm thinking. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I just don't, I don't know if this is really worth giving armor. No, nah, this is not great. Ah, uh, he did have the popper. Yeah. Um, I think I'm okay with this. I think I'm gonna play this. Okay. I stole this card. Oh, <sighs> disaster has struck. I think I'm just gonna play. 
Mm, do I actually target Pierce? Yeah, we'll hold. I should actually should target Pierce in this case, I think. Yeah, if you just have the one attack. I yeah, think yeah, yeah. Like I, I basically never target auras, but this is only three damage I'm losing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely makes sense. Um, man. I don't this like this. Really awkward, actually. I, I don't like how this played out at I all. I, I don't like how this is happening either. <laughs> so I think we're in the same. Okay. <laughs> um, damn. All right. So I'm A being one. Which of these do I not want? Um, I think this is probably more valuable. Maybe. No. no I think I'm gonna. I think we're gonna pitch this. Pitch one more. Oh, sorry. That, that, was, to, that was fast. Priority here. Yeah, I need to hold some priority here. I always forget the, the full control button. Yeah. So that'll happen. Yep. So you have zero action points, no floating. So I think I'm going to go Genesis. Mm -hmm. Ooh, it's actually a hard choice. Oh my, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my word, this is I'm 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 feeling a little lucky right now. <laughs> Sorry, right. my hands have been a little stinky. All right. So this doesn't have go again on this current. It does. It does. Oh, it does. Yep. If you have played, uh, if you have played or created one or more auras. Yeah, this creates the first root chance on the turn, so it has the first mode. Which one creates the? Sorry, which one creates the first root chance? Storm and Gloomvale. Vale. Triggers Viscerai, so I create one root chant on the back end, Sorry. and that counts. Oh, because oh, you played Runic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. I got you. Six, and after that I can't block. Oh my goodness. Um, well. Not blocking that. Seems right. It does suck, because now I can't prevent... Oh no, because you only have one. Yeah, 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 that's only if I create three. Okay, yeah, yeah, we're fine. But the question is, do I even do what I thought I was going to do? I actually had two poppers on that triumph turn. And I couldn't use my hand, because I had four attacks <laughs> in my hand. That's really awkward. Alright, this is coming in for six total? Twelve total. Six and six, yeah. Uh... I don't think it's worth um, losing six damage to target Genesis with this. No, no, it's not. I don't think I so. Been putting out any. You're you're ahead in the race right now for sure. Yeah. Genesis might come and clutch. It also might just not do anything at all. You know. Yeah. I mean, you have to you have to spend three cards to play it, and like if the game lasts three turn cycles, it, it doesn't really. It's usually fine. I don't. I don't think every um, game is gonna look like last one. No, I think, I think it really is just who hits the who hits what they need first, which is. Do you think I you think I block um, the protection on turn zero last game with armor? Do you think I blocked that for four? That was turn one. No, it was your. It, you went first, and you went seven seven. And, and yeah. I, I forgot that you were gonna search for a ponder token. I was like, well, he doesn't have an arsenal, so I'm just gonna not block with armor. But I guess maybe I just block with armor there. Oh, I see. Maybe. Um, I don't know. If. I swung 7-7. Seven, seven. You blocked the first one, right? Yeah. Um, there is an argument for it. The you the thing is that you really want armor to be able to you could I mean, you have like air addition and to block with. Uh, just balance grasp. Because I had a three uh, yeah, uh had a three yeah, block. I, I don't think. I'm not sh because Herald of Air Edition is really scary. I can also whiff on the ponder. That's true. So it's like, I did that. I, I did that last night. 
Yeah. <laughs> no, I feel like there's like 75% hits in this deck, and I feel like I miss 75% of them. It's so tragic. <laughs> yeah, I was playing. All right. I, I was on the aura plan, and I drew, I pondered like a celestial cataclysm. And I was like, mm, no. <laughs> well, thanks. Uh, I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna commit. I'm gonna try and salvage the sands, but I need all of it to do that. So. Sold that Dude, one. <laughs> wait a second. I've seen like four non-attacks total. Mm -hmm. What the hell? <laughs> I've drawn fifteen cards, and four of them are non-attacks. So cool. That is not what we like to see. This is so cool. So, this is this is where Pierce starts getting mad value, right? Mm-hmm. I still think I'm in a deep ditch, but we'll see. Um, I guess I just fucking block. This is very cringe. I guess I block like this. Fine. No, no, no. Hello. No. That's why I needed all the hands. He got me. Because now, now we do this. How did this happen? Now, now we flip. Maybe I should have let you draw first so I could balance. Maybe, but I mean, you just get to do it now. Like I can't. Yeah, but not no, but right but now. now I don't know if I want to because, like, my hand is gonna be unplayable anyway. Oh, because you already you already because I blocked and stuff. Interesting. But I didn't think that yeah, you would draw two this turn. I, don't know. I mean, I might I might have a so... chance to play it later. Ooh. Hmm. Like I could just like clear Genesis or something. Feels kind of bad though. Well, given that you didn't block, I think we commit to the aggressive line. Okay. Yeah. No. Give me my free soul. <laughs> I got scammed. Cards got revealed. What's going on? Oh yeah. What do we see? That was a passing. No, no, no. I meant <laughs> I'm, I meant spoiler cards. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. <laughs> oh hell yeah. Um. Well, we already saw that one. Oh, well, never mind. Yeah, this, this kind of blows. I haven't seen this one. Unless it's a hero. It's CNC light. Why Why do the brutes keep getting all of the CNC cards? Because uh, they, they yeah. didn't have enough. LSS, LSS hasn't given them enough recently. <laughs> so this is, this is where I buy back my action point and swing with the 0 for 4 illuminated in my arsenal. Whoa! No, I don't have that. <laughs> That'd be cool though. <laughs> Can you imagine, dude? Uh, I think I just killed Genesis. This kind of blows. Taking an entire off turn. But whatever. I think it might be worth yeah. losing four damage for this. Maybe. Maybe I just target Prism. Uh, you can you can change your twist if you want. I don't know. I mean, you're at 15, I but I, don't know why I think if you honest. get, I think if you activate Genesis like twice, then it would have been worth killing it. So I should probably just kill it. Yeah. yeah. See the awkward thing here. Oh, the awkward thing for you though. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, make sure we have full control here. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> Say it isn't true. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, this. I, I, I mean, I don't really care. Like three cards to resolve this is pretty expensive. Yeah, but the problem is that you left Soraya on the board. Yeah, but that's so I could use my balance of justice. That's fair, that's fair. Yeah, maybe I should keep like a four power attack and just kill Soraya. Maybe that's better than Genesis. 
Alright, so now I have a choice. I think, unfortunately, I have to install this. My... So, yeah, so that I have a guarantee. Yeah, yeah, leaving Soraya was a strategic choice. <laughs> the card that I'm going to draw is worth more than the two cards that you're going to draw. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, that's some real shit right there. Oh, man. I'm literally at a loss for what to do here. I'm gonna block here. In case I see a popper or something. Wait, why is is the resolution step? Oh, why am I holding all this priority? I don't need to do that. Oh my gosh. Alright, um this may seem troll. However, <laughs> what did we see on the draw? However, if I survive, I think it's pretty pog. Oh! <laughs> so we'll just what? we'll just commit and we'll see what happens. What did you have in your <laughs> hand? What, did, what were the two cards you drew? Um. So I had I started the turn with a red herald of protection, a yellow herald of erudition. I had this. I had the Genesis trigger the protection, so I had the yellow. So I pitched, and then I got um, a blue war tune off of the drawn Genesis, and then I drew a Soraya and drew Figment of Rebirth and Genesis. <laughs> so you could so just, just go like Herald. You go like War Tune Herald. I could, something. Herald. I could have thrown a Herald, but at this point, my way back is somehow. Spectre Ooh, value. this. Uh huh. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Uh oh. <laughs> That's what we call stinky. I'm not a fan. I like this a lot. Yeah, I'm targeting Prism. Yeah, no, you definitely do. <laughs> I mean, it's coming in for. You're not gonna. You're not gonna have cards in your hand to put into Genesis. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, the nice thing. Six card Viscera hand. Yeah, no kidding. Balance of Justice is a card they printed. Um, okay, so it has go again and it has plus one, but it does not have when this hits a hero. Um, that's correct, yeah. Okay. I can, if I activate Creepers, I can make a rune chant in the reaction step to turn it on. But you do have ward. Spicy. At this point, you have ward, so it wouldn't hit, actually. Yeah. It can't um, possibly hit. Could, I could keep Sarai alive, but also there's no point because you chance. So we'll just we'll just let whatever's gonna happen happen and hope that I have something of a hand. So we're gonna be tied on six cards, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's wild. There's no reason to creepers here. Gotta read read the card. Uh oh. Uh oh. Tutor effect. It has to be just seven reaches. Nice swarming or something. Oh my goodness, no. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, it's a. Hey, I have good news like for that. you. If you pitch eleven resources, then this will not have go again. You'll need to pitch nine because you have uh, the. Well, actually, no, because you you, you have the special have, shields. Uh, if you pitch nine right wait, now, wait, wait. then this doesn't can go again. Just give me three blues. Um. If yeah. you have dealt or deal arcane damage. I have not. I like that. So I have, 11. Yeah. 9, 13, and then. Oh boy. <laughs> Let's see. I think. Can I salvage this? I wish I could close, I could minimize this like rune chant window. Yeah, like move it around. Can yeah. I... You can you can press show arena, the eyeball. Oh. Is that what you're talking about? Yeah. Genius. Genius. Let's see. Alright, I'm gonna talk through my line out loud here because I think I'm dead otherwise. So I could. Let's see. So you're dealing 15. 19 damage 
21 because right, meet, meet and greet is going to create two more. The Vistar trigger hasn't resolved. If it hits, it will create four oh. more. So 21 or 23 damage I'm presenting right here. But those, oh yeah, because they pop on that. Holy shit. Yeah. Okay. Um, if this gains go again. <laughs> that's a lot of damage. Um, all right, here's the question. I have... Claim victory? Two blues, a yellow, and a red. <laughs> okay, you fast. could pitch your entire um, hand. <laughs> I could. See, the thing is, is I think I actually, I might have a halo play. Because mm -hmm. I can turn this red into not a red, hopefully. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The problem is that you're at 30. I just have to, I'm just going to, we're going to do it and see what happens. So if we do this and we do that. Okay. That's better. Because this, this one card is actually going to, going to block four. So now I just have to deal with. Some of your I deal with nine for enchants. Like flip an angel and pitch nine. To soak yeah. up the entire thing. Well, I don't want to soak up the entire thing because so now prism triggers right now. I have to see what's actually going on in the stack. Yep, there we go. Um because I can get a figment of protection. Mm, okay. So that's one more. Uh-huh. So now I have to block eight. Do you have two blues? Oh, it's so doomed. Actually, no, it's not. Actually, no, it's not. It's not, though. Because I have two genocide. Genocide. <laughs> um, Genesis? Genesis. So I need to, I need to, okay. I think, I think I have, I see, I see the line. Um... I have to pitch one. 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 I wish there was just like pitch this much total, please. Yeah. Okay. So another four green chance. So I've oh, there's another four. Why is there another four? There are 11, and I thought I AB'd. Uh, you were one. Seven. Oh, I only AB'd seven. Oh, it's doomed. You needed two blues, yeah. <laughs> oh, I needed one more blue. <laughs> um, actually, actually, I think. So, meet and greet creates how many? Your Vistar checker creates two, and then if it hits, I'll create okay. two more. Okay, why does it create two more on the hit? Oh, when just, it ICS. Just, just meet and greet, yeah. Sense. There's so much text on these cards, man. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. And every time it says rune chant, it, it and they they write out what a rune chant is on the card for you. So then it'd be another twelve damage. Holy. Um. Well, I mean, I can live and not take like much damage at least. I think it's worth it to like pitching a red to prevent me from having go again blocks more than blocking for three, right? Well, I have the I have the protection. So the so if I drew another blue, and I can keep my hand here, I can double Genesis, free flip, swing protection, and at least have at least something of like a defensive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. If you have two state. blues, that's pretty good. Yeah, this is this is just tragic. Oh, I'm so sad. I mean, well, we'll just, it's, it's close. So we'll just block this out. Yeah. Take a little bit of damage from my troubles. I don't know. Now you're on now though. Now you're on, uh, yeah, and I would have been in a much better place if I could have had one more resource to pitch there. I mean, still, it's, it's still like a tall mountain to climb for you, but not over. Oh yeah, but I, I have at this point, I, I would have been able to swing four and have ward, 
one word one and one word, which is like yeah, yeah, <laughs> that's fine. pretty good. So after like blocking how much damage? <laughs> oh <laughs> yeah, know? yeah, <laughs> twenty um, damage. I actually. I think. So kind of an awkward hand. I have to open with Crackle. I'm just going to Creeper Sonata, okay. so and there's a one, decent chance. If Sonata hits, I might just end with two cards in my hand uh, that I can't use. It's a little unfortunate, but... I think there is something I miss said for not this in taking arsenal. any damage yet. Is there anything... So meet and greet gives go again if you don't. Arcane, is there any other... That's right. Um, consuming Volition is the only other one. Consuming Volition that gains... destroys Arsenal? D Consuming Volition gains discard on hit if you've taken Arcane damage. Oh, that's also scary. Um, but it, it's four, right? Yeah, it's a one for four. Um... Let's do this. Let's keep options open. Though arguably by making that play, I did not keep options open, but... <laughs> yeah, that hand where I drew all blues was what, tragic. What? Yeah, I was just did you mean to do that? <laughs> I, I put on... Okay, that's weird that it works like that, but... Change this back now. Hey, uh, Swarm Glue Veil, please. Okay, that's acceptable. That was just nothing, though, wasn't it? Yeah, <laughs> that was an action point. That's what that was. Well, I mean... We take that. I will accept. I do. I lose my creepers this way. So, I mean, pitching to AB mm -hmm. broke my creepers, if nothing else. Okay. I guess that's true. So, this will create a rune chat on hit. I don't think I can afford to block it. My only three block. My only blocking card I actually need for my turn. So, uh. <laughs> Classic. Then I think we'll flip here with the floats. Yeah, that seems good. Yeah, it's fine. I draw a playable hand. It's oh, a miracle. I Genesis. Ah, it's a miracle. Oh, when I get another you Genesis. get two Genesis. Oh. Two Genesis. Oh, Genesis. And two holy, special shields. Holy, I can do damage. Imagine you don't um, take any damage for the rest of the game. That would be... I'm getting flashbacks to the RTN. <laughs> holy shit. No, I whiffed. Oh, it could have been so good. Never lucky, man. That hit. It was big. <laughs> You never hit. Do I'm gonna want be to banish a card from Soul? Um. Damn. Uh, let's see. Don't you? Yeah. Unless you have like yeah. a Celestial Cataclysm, isn't there no reason not to? I have. I do have a Sea Cat, but I think it's getting pitched for the other card. Oh, in my okay. Hand. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I think it was getting pitched anyway, to be honest. But it was. It was cool that it happened. Now we come in so you already you already flipped this turn, right? No, I flipped I flipped on on your turn. Oh, so you will get a free With flip. A flip from the AB. So if oh. this hits, uh, actually, what did I what did I put into Genesis? Um, um, uh, not a herald. So yeah, if you block it, I don't get to. If you block it, one, I don't get another figment, and two, I can't flip it. You did. You did not put a herald in soul this turn. Not, not yet. Not yet. I'm not blocking it anyway. Yeah, I, I think it's bad for you to block it. Like actively bad. So. Yeah. You like you if to do anything you'd have to full block it. So. So this card blocks for two, and instead I'm gonna pitch to grasp for plus two damage. So I'm going to keep this in my hand. Um, and I'm also saving a two-hit counter. Two damage. A Mordred. No. No. <laughs> I give you an extra card. Okay. Basically, to pitch to grasp. Um, 
This is unfortunate. I I have my two I have Genesis. My in this deck, apparently. I think I'm fine, but still, it's kind of annoying. You have more. Take grab it. It's just to have some seven threats. Arcane damage. Um, <laughs> oh wait. Uh, was that incorrect? I don't know. Whatever. Do you I think we're just flipping it for the flip it for yeah. life? Yeah. Yep. And I oh, if I had a blue, if I had drawn a blue, uh, I just take <laughs> six more damage. Jeez. Yeah, that would have been good. <laughs> all of my all of my hands have been like one resource off from being cracked. Yeah, this, I'm actually which really is, which is whatever. I'm really close to losing this game actually. It's really annoying. Uh, amplify. Yeah, I have to target Prism. Yeah, as soon as you start giving me space to clear it, I this isn't the problem. Is that once yeah. I have a board state and you take time to clear it, all of a sudden yeah. I've stabilized. Yep, it's it's too late now. So this is interesting. Because I know you have a lead the charge in hand. Um, which has gained an action point, which means you have creeper shenanigans. Well, I have Mob already. Oh, Bob. This, this has to go again. Let's go in, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, I think we'll pitch I, zero. Yeah, no, I can't target. I think we'll pitch zero. I think we'll pitch zero. Um, this is actually kind of a hard choice. So Mob creates two on hit? Yeah, but with the Angels, I can't hit. Because I target the yeah, Prism. I'm just... I think what I need to do, actually... It feels bad. Wow, that's... I think I should do this. That's efficient. Yes. Yes, it is. Because then it just comes in for four and one. Wow! AB1. Yes! I love Prism. Woo! Me too. Dude, no way the I'm losing this game. My next turn is, my, my next turn is going to be really bad. Because... That's good news because if I lose, <laughs> this is going to be so tragic. <laughs> Dude, okay. um... why? This is... I'm gonna lose five games and then not post this. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this is because I either pitch one, swing protection. And Arsenal the other card. I think I have to do that. I think I have to do that. So I think we sold that one. I think we sold that one. Just not another red, please. Oh sorry. You mind if I do that? Yeah, yeah, I know. It's the white card. Tragic. Uh, pitch one to AB. Yes. Okay. I'm not doing this because I saw what card I drew. Yeah, I know. Draw, it's... As the case may be. <laughs> In fact, it was the fact that I didn't see. A draw, <laughs> you but... didn't see a draw. Oh, you would like. You would like to see one this time. I would. I would like to see one. Um. I did that. Okay, so the other question is, I think I, I think I need. Oh. This is okay. I don't love it. My hand is a little weird. Okay, so. Okay. So here's the thing. Here's the only thing I have going for me. I have four spectral fields. Yeah, that's and four soul. That's pretty like the big. Only thing going for me. I I don't have shit. Because I broke creepers. Eh, totally on purpose. This is... I could block with this, but... Um... I just have to play this out. <sighs> My oh. head is so bad. Oh, oh no. I guess I do I pitch? No. Interesting. Why are you targeting me on that? Um, if I target the angel, you can break it with a rune chant, and then I lose go again. 
Yeah, th this is true. But why not a spectra? Because it has your creepers are gone, right? Yeah, so I can't. I can't. I lose. Oh, go again. Go again for mob. Go again for mob. Duh. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. 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 I was like, why? Yes, it makes sense now. That is um... better than nothing. I think I'm losing this game. This is unbelievable. I, it's going to be close because I'm just about out of angels is the problem. That's fair. That didn't occur to me. Oh, I oh. did not check <laughs> to see if I have a swarming left in the been... deck. <laughs> I, don't, I don't have a swarming gloom veil. Do I have... Um, well, I have one floating. It's actually fine. This is a little awkward, though. Uh, I guess so. Okay, so three and then three with go again. Oh my gosh, and then you can... Um... Genesis is crazy. And you can Nebula Blade. Um, I don't think I pitch. Still don't think I pitch. Still don't think I pitch. The question is if I block. That's the real question. Oh, no, it's not because... And I would like to see a Revel in Moonblood, please. Nope. Oh, and you get a card. Oh. Um... That's pretty good, though. Mm, this is stinky. Okay, so you're coming in for four and one after this, right? Yeah. Oh, hate that. I should have pitched. I should have pitched to AB. No, because I saw the same problem. It was absorbing the chance anyway. And I don't, unfortunately, I don't have any other pitch outlets. Which is pretty tragic. So I can't keep, well, I could, I could keep Aegis alive. I actually could. What would I have to do? I'd have to block here. I'd have to pitch and then block another one and keep one card. Mm, looks like you're slow playing. I'm going to have to claim I... the victory. <laughs> I'm going to call Damon. <laughs> Hey, man. Judge. Oh, man. Um, lock that. I have to pitch still. I actually think I should have AB'd the three rune chips earlier. In front. Do you want me to undo it? Yeah. See if this works. Yeah. If you oh, would. it's okay. Um, we'll just redo this. Oh, yeah, I mean, just play your turn out. This is fine, yeah. I think I actually should pitch there because having the more granular blocks is a lot better, I think. It may not even matter. Because I think even here, it might be smart to block. You could pitch it like her footsteps. I think that's the play. I think that is actually the play. I was thinking, because earlier I was like, there's no way that I like spend a whole card to do this. But I think there actually is. I think I... No, sorry. Pitched wrong card. Oh, oh. Didn't have to. <laughs> I, I, I need the three block. One oh. more time. <laughs> My gracious opponent. I mean, honestly, if you... If I take cards from your hand, it's a win. Yeah, so, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna let you know a secret. I don't have a yellow right now. Uh -huh. Which means I don't have go again, which means I have to try and uh -huh. uh, figure out the minimum viable turn. Oh, so oh, I see. So you drew you drew the red mob off the first. Um, I had two mobs, and I drew the draw to the dark dimension. Yeah, I drew the become the arc knight. I wonder. I don't know if this is gonna draw me oh. the same card. We'll find out. It should. But I did, like, I... Because I tutored... I, I don't, don't think... Okay, so here's here's the question. 
So it's coming in for three. The physical attack is coming in for three. Yeah. And then one and four. Okay, so I think the actual play is... I got it. I got it. Okay, so I have to take these. No, so I A, B these. I don't have it anymore. I thought I did. So three, three, one, four. Wait, why do you have two ring chimes now? I thought you only had one the last time. Um, no, I had two. Because okay. I, I played mob going up to two. Yeah, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. So it's three, three, two, four. Three, three, two. So I need to use this floating to cover two room chance. This one is okay if it gets absorbed. Um, that one. Oh, goodness. It always goes a little bit too far back. <laughs> do I want to keep the red or do I want to keep the blue? So this becomes attacking. I mean, Genesis is going to draw you yellow, right? Hopefully. No, even that isn't like good enough because I can only throw one thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. If you, you, need, you would need to keep like three cards. Oh, I'm like, I'm, but I'm... It doesn't matter because the answer is I'm putting it in soul anyway, which I'm I don't keep. So. Yeah. And then Nebula Blade, yeah. Mm hmm And we can take one arcane. No, we take zero arcane barrier. Spectral Shield goes away. Or oh man. Oh. You want to know a fun trick? Mm -hmm, I do. This has one block. Oh, no. <laughs> it's still not quite enough. It's still not quite enough. Oh, For the whole turn. Age? That's so lame. I could keep, I could keep ages. I could. Wait, so technically, Instead of pitching to one of those rune chants, you could have pitched to footsteps a second time and it gains a second block, right? No, no, no. It, oh, it, it becomes it one. one. It doesn't yep. give it plus one. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'd be yep. cracked. That would be stupid. That would be insane. <laughs> Against pistol dash, that would block six off of a blue. The world is angry enough about Prism. <laughs> no kidding. So. <sighs> I don't know what the right answer is. I think... I think the answer is... Let Aegis die. Oh, but my Spectral Shields, bro. It's no, I can't let her die. She's done so well for me, I can't let her die. I have I have the block already. I should, I should keep her alive. I think that seems right to me, because you can just swing and make two shields. Yeah. Yellow, please. Okay, how many reds do I have in one, two... Dude, the special shields are so three, brutal. Four, five... I still have four reds. Four reds and 32. I don't... I don't think... I mean, you just decline the second one, right? Yeah, I can't... I can't risk not drawing Yeah, there's the no reason to risk that. I think I just keep just this. Yeah, I mean, you just try and kill me. <clears throat> this is bad. I think I'm actually losing. Unbelievable. Well, actually... If, I mean, if you don't... 
Maybe Rebel and Runeblood can get me there. Oh, an extra four. Please, it's something good. No. <laughs> Rebel and Runeblood cannot get me there. Oh, I'll do that. I'll tell you, this is the strangest Invisorai game I've ever played. Yeah, Usually this... it's one of us is dead. Not yeah, this like is super weird. On the brink of life. It's it's the Genesis is what it is, because otherwise I would have had like two arc lights, and that's like I think I think Genesis is the plane of this matchup. It's just it's just too good. Do I just play this? This is so bad. Oh, this is just not good enough. I'm just dead. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I might agree with you there, my friend. I'm um, gonna draw a Rebel and Moonblood right now. Because you have no. You do have Gogan. I'm gonna draw it off the Gogan. top. Um. So, Drawn to the Dark Dimension is coming in for four. Yeah. Oh, man. Um. But notably, no rune check. Okay, I think here I'm going to cash this in. Yeah, this is over. I have weathered the storm. I don't know if this is right, but I think it is. Uh, well, actually, maybe it's not. Oh, yeah, because if you just enable the blade. The thing is, like, when you have two Genesis, I, like, if I kill one, it basically doesn't matter. So. Yeah, I mean, it does. It lets me filter, but a lot of the times I can't take both triggers. You know. Yeah, like it just doesn't matter if I kill one at this point. I it's better like to just take spectral shields. <laughs> And I can't, I yeah. can't target Aegis because then you just let the rune chant kill it. So, mm -hmm. so I lose the on hit regardless. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you can't get the on hit. Well, actually, you kind of can. Here, you're either forcing me to block or do it. See, I'm in the problem again. Where do I just keep the? I could just keep the um, Aegis around and banish drop two again. I could do that, but I actually think the right play here, I think you're low enough. Uh, I could go for one more turn. I can present eight next turn, but that's it. Do you have any figments left? I do have one figment. You have a uh, rebirth or something. And it's actually it's actually a pretty big figment, if I'm being honest. Oh, is it Bologna or rebirth? Can... No, no, it's rebirth. I probably should have saved oh, the Bologna for there, it, there it to is. be honest. But I can. All right, we're gonna we're gonna cash in on the word four here finally. They don't have any red whiffs, is the thing. If I draw a red, the only reds I have are heralds. If I draw a red herald, I play it. Everything else is a yep, so I can sell that one. I can't swing. But you can. I can't flip. swing in an angel, unfortunately, but I can flip it. So you're going to six spectral shields. <laughs> Yep. Wild. Seems good. You have sea strikes as well, right? So I can't pivot to fatigue you. Yep. Yeah, it's just not possible. 
I mean, you get through one more angel. Yeah, like you only have one angel, Genesis, but I have a hard time locking you. But out. you have the soul but to play cataclysms. Yeah, it's just this is just over. I five special shields, six and award four. Unbelievable that I lose this. <laughs> it's, I felt like I was about to die any second. That was the thing. So it's like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, so close. I don't know. I'm not sure if I did anything wrong or not. Um, all of those games, I was one damage. I think, or all of those turns, I was one damage away from losing. Ages. That's true. Um. <sighs> What do I keep here? If I, go also, to I wonder I wonder if there was ever a chance for you to attack me with a big attack. Attack a Spectra with a small attack, do creepers, and then one more big attack. Yeah. Because the problem is that if you use Nebula Blade at the end, that's five damage down the drain, four damage at the very least. But if you if you attack it like with one of those drawn to the dark dimensions, is that what it's called, yeah, yeah, like the blue one or something, maybe maybe it could have worked. So this is extremely bad. I also I don't have any poppers left either. Uh, I have passing, and because I'm That's true. one herald. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I'm gonna have to block two, spend two to swing, anywhere from seven to nine. How many? This is this, this doesn't even take any cards. We have six shields. I swing four, six, ten. And you'll you'll have exactly ward ten actually. Oh, is it like 10 damage that you can present? Yeah, on three cards. Like, I can't. If I had a two block, so, oh, then you're I could. about blocking one more? Or selling a card or something. Because mm -hmm. if I have if I have a two block, I can block with two cards, but I don't. Yeah. So, so at this point in the game, because I've decided to cash an Aegis, I've essentially locked myself into. Um, see if you can prevent 15 damage at me. And if you can't, I'm just going to keep my whole hand and send two heralds instead of one. The problem is if that doesn't kill you, then I'm in a bad spot because I don't have a spectral shield stack anymore. You mean how much... You mean I should... Do you think I should just block? Uh... I don't. You should not just block. You need to. You need to strip head cards. If I block, I just die, right? Yeah. If you block, the problem is I just swing with. Four yeah. Cards. The thing is, once you flip, I actually can't strip cards. So this is just. Oh. That's what yeah, I'm saying. That's an issue. Yeah. That's an issue. It, like I need a revel or something, because my hand is not good enough to get through ward ten. I I'm presenting exactly ten know, damage. Do I, I don't. I don't think I want a herald of judgment on top of my deck. That's the only. <laughs> what the heck? Yeah, because everything else is hit. It's so funny. I, think I blocked with this one, and that's why it's there. That's the one um, I popped. No, because I still have. Yeah, it's the only pop. I still have um, air additions in there. I don't think I want to do it with my deck. I think we flip. I guess actually, I. Can target Avalon here. It is your if last. You have no sense, then yeah, you can. Maybe I should have blocked with one more and just. It's only a blue mob, so I'm only getting plus one rune chant anyway. But I, yeah. I still should target her. Yeah, then you get the on hit at least. Yeah, like, I don't think killing Genesis even does anything. Not anymore. No, it would have happened to have... It needs to I needed to kill... Yeah, because you have two already. 
Pierce is like just plus two health, but you have six spectral shields, so. Yeah, yeah I mean, here I just hope that I can kill you. The unfortunate thing is I have two blue heralds. That's lucky. So it may not, but I think I, I, think I still strip. Also, have you not played a Herald of Erudition all game? Um, I've pitched one. I've had to pitch one, and I haven't seen any. Yeah, I mean, you've shuffled now. Herald of Erudition just wins the game too. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So we're just, we're just. Oh wait, no, I have, I have Genesis. I just get to like shuffle them all. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that's such a correct card. Okay, um, is that enough? That's almost enough. Um, well, at the very least, I have my yellow. Um, I keep this. So this is seven into six. If I run this hand as it is, seven into six. Which means you have to block seven, which is like three cards. But like, it's seven into six no matter what. So I think I still just do that. Okay. Oh, it's now this one's eight into seven. Yeah. We do this. Hmm. <laughs> Get smacked. Right, this is really over. Turns out a one card seven go again is pretty big, right? I guess I should. Save this Let for me here. This oh. one. This one has no phantasm because. Of... Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's over. Yeah, and I, I even get our stone card. Oh my goodness, that was weird. That happened. I should have been. I should have been recording my perspective as well. That was something. Yeah, the, oh, I'm gonna try. Um. I don't know if this really makes a difference. I'm gonna try adding a seven power attack in the deck, though. Oh uh, yeah, I mean, because right now the deck runs those zero. Are annoying. Yeah, do you, you only have just the just six poppers with the and the? Yeah. Yeah. The only. Are you making any lobby then? Yeah. Okay. The only. The only. Potential problem I see with that is that if if you well I mean you never brick on them because you just use them to shut me down right yeah I don't really like popping things very much but we'll see how it goes yeah I don't know if these <laughs> the best three out of five <laughs> that's it. Yeah, no, Jordan did the same thing. He was like, man, I feel like this matchup is favored, but I am just cursed. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I you're like playing it really well. Like, to be, to be clear, like, most prisms are either, like, it's not often that, like, Genesis is like your silver bullet in these last two games. Yeah, I think, I, there's no way. I, I am so off the idea of ALS into aggro matchups. Yeah, period, I mean, because, like, Scott played like full aura combo plan against me and mm -hmm. then like you've tried just full herald beat down without um als but this is a lot harder i think than either of those versions probably yeah i guess i take this out okay Look at me. You don't have AB again. Do you want to redo that? Oh, yeah, that's that's my bad. Dang, I had a good hand. <laughs> um actually, actually let's let's run it out. I'm interested. Do you want to just run it? Yeah, I'll just run it. It worked for you once, so I actually think that Yeah, I think there's I think there's an argument for it. Especially with the metagame knowledge that you uh put sevens in. I think I think now that yeah yeah I think I think now that Droma is gone I think sevens are going to be a lot more common. Yeah. 
I mean, it just it wasn't a matchup that we were like trying to tech for. And I also I yeah, started I just you should. I started just taking poppers out. Like I didn't play all six poppers or seven I had. Mm -hmm. I started just not playing the CNCs, and that's what I did. Yeah. The last two games. Why the why? Well, what are my zero hands, dude? Out of like four. Zero out of four on my line soul hits. It's so tragic. What are my ratios even? Hold on. I need to know exactly how much to be salty. Once again, blocking a Herald of Triumph with my Grasp. <laughs> I'll but take it. That might not be worth it. Actually, I guess maybe I should block with the balance. Uh, I think you always block yeah. with balance first. Yeah, because I can save the Grasp for an Air Edition. Yeah, well, it's like you, you just want to have your because I might your balance. Because yeah, 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 like whatever. if you if you swing um, Angel of Air Edition, then I want to block with balance and 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 draw two a draw one. So I'd rather save the grass block. So here's the question. The answer is no. <laughs> what do you think? So I have the option of either throwing another red triumph. Or playing an draw aura. passing. Yeah. So uh, I can draw passing and arsenal the red triumph or swing the red triumph. I think I swing it. The reason being is because passing's effect is redundant if I have a triumph arsenal. Yeah, yeah. Kind of, yeah. But like you also you and, like, and if I hit I get a You also know what was that? You know based on how I just blocked that I'm not gonna be able to pop a second triumph. You're gonna gain an angel. So it's like eleven damage. Mm, 11 yeah, points sure. of value yeah because you'd have to give me the other two cards and grasp yeah, yeah and that would be a huge win for I you think that's true yeah and i just get air edition here and maybe get a ponder uh yeah we'll take that ponder um this hand is interesting And it's a big amp. All right, gotta turn my spell point up. Okay. Nine. Do I care? Yeah, I can't believe that double Genesis worked out, dude. <laughs> it does feel pretty <laughs> tragic, yeah. It looks so doomed because if I ever, as long as I take four cards from your hand, it just doesn't matter. But then I couldn't take four cards for the rest of the game. Yeah. Ah, <sighs> yes. I could leave here, make you have the seven. You, you can have, have, you can have seven, that. It's okay. I'm going to cash in my free value. Thank you. Actually, that was, was that done? No. Maybe? Maybe that was done. I forget that I can, like, awaken Air Edition and swing. But also, there's, like, so often so many cards that I could do this. I actually, so I have two souls, so I do get to cash in on Uh, Lens the Justice. I actually don't think I'm going to do it this turn. I think. Oh. Dude, if I lose every game, I don't know if I can post it. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll ask you for the for the thing and I'll post it in the prison chat instead. <laughs> <laughs> guys, Vissari is unlosable, guys. Anyway. Look at us go. How did this uh, guy I ever win an like, RTN? Whenever... You're right? Um, do I flip and swing, or do I just play this out? Oh, man. I actually think I'm going to be a little bit more patient this game and see how it goes. Hmm. I'm wondering if I should have blocked... Not flip anything. Um, not flipping. Block six. No, yeah. well... We'll see. I can't really defend whatever I flip. 
Right, I mean, you don't, have, you don't, have, you don't have Nolru in this thing. game. Yeah. So, I, okay. think, I think I just wait until I have a bigger turn. It'd be funny if I pitch six into this right now. That would be pretty funny. It's gonna pitch zero. I don't... Uh, I really want this to hit, otherwise my hand is kind of... Uh, redundant. I was, I was kind of planning on blocking the next thing. Okay, that's... That's good. Oh, you're planning on blocking the next thing, and then the next thing never came? Yeah, then you played a Pierce. Mm. Well, because also, if you, sw yeah. if you swung air addition, I was going to draw, and my hand like could get a lot better. But That's true, that's true. Um, I feel like it is it's, a, a it little bit out. of chicken with the, with the balance. Yeah. Which is interesting. But I, I, cause if Sonata misses, I can't actually like use my whole hand, but it didn't miss. So, mm -hmm. well, wait. Okay. So this has go again. No, it was fine. Never turn. mind. It was actually fine. Okay. Okay. Oh man. The most awkward thing in the world is having to play around the possibility of needing Halo. Because it's like you really just, I, I would love to just be able to block two cards, play two cards. But the problem is that those two cards are nullified by one if I don't have... Either the Halo play? The rest, yeah, if I don't have it available. <clears throat> so if this hits, you get three, you're coming in for seven? This is, this is a, yeah. It's a blue mob on hit. Weird. Um, I actually think I'm going to take the middle ground here. Which is weird. So I think the thing about A B is like the last game where you like um where you were like about to die and then you stabilized. Without uh, no rune gloves, you just die. Right. Like no rune A B yeah, one is... gives you the chance to stay alive in a game like that. Like, that game is not over because you have AB. If you don't have AB, you just die in a lot of those spots. And that's, that's like, the difference. Change. So, like, this game, if it goes similar, like, you can resolve a Genesis at 5 health, but if I find one Revelin Runeblood, you just die on the spot. But, yeah. like, if you have AB1 and, like, you keep literally one card in your hand to swing Aegis every turn, then you suddenly don't die and then you go on to win the game somehow. Yeah, that is that is an interesting. So like, even though it's one of those things where like people always say in aggro matchups, they're like, "Well, if I have a B, I'm never pitching to it anyway." But it it saves you yeah, in an end game. It is, it is like super valuable. Yeah, it's like it's it's more of an out than something you're actively doing early game. But like late game, just having it, you can like mm. come back from a game that looks over. This feels a little bit more like how I expect the matchup to go. Yeah. Um, I think I made at least two misplays so far, like pretty pertinent ones. This hand is fine, I guess. Draw four cards this turn? Oh, okay. Not quite that good. I will allow it to happen. You'll allow it. Out of the goodness of my heart, Josh. Um, I appreciate that so much. Uh, I think it's got to be... Oh, I got my graveyard. Nothing. Um, well, I can't flip it this turn, but that's okay. So this, if I think I need the life, this is, I think I can survive next turn to put some damage. 
which ones I think is this one. And now we get those really what scary... Happened? We drew two cards. Oh, actually, the funny thing is there's actually an argument not... To, to just not draw. draw. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, I just got giga punished, so... For drawing? Yeah. Ooh, lucky yep. me, it's my lucky yep. day. Yep, it's tragic. It's so tragic. And I'm gonna draw a Revel in Runeblood, thank you. This, this is acceptable. This is not good for me. Yeah, I should have, I actually think I should have awoken... Ravages there. Because then you don't get the balance. I think... I honestly think not drawing with Sarai is off in the play. Yeah, it's kind of funny how that works. Oh, you can't right, even well, use... Can't... Oh! Oh, God. Oh, oh this is ugly. Or else. This is ugly. I actually you're just dead to rune chance. Because you don't have AB. See? Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. Yeah, but like... This is not a board state where I can stabilize our glass game. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. The, see, this... This game lasted like five minutes. <laughs> it's true. This one I really have to like boonga boonga. Oh, and that just fixed my hand. God yeah, bless. I mean, I don't, I'm not even. I have two non blocks, so if you. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't have a single herald in this hand. Oh, that's tragic. My draw off of Soraya, by the way, was. Um... A figment of Ravages and Pierce Reality with a blue Angelic Wrath and Arsenal. Oh, yummy. Oh, yeah, tragic. I should have blocked there, but I don't think yeah, I Yeah, watch what, this. So. Uh, some more Rune Chance yeah, oh, and yeah, have some yeah, more Rune Chance, so please. Good. And have uh, yeah. uh, some yeah, more Rune it. Chance. That'll do it. Yep. Okay, yeah. three out of five, it's reverse sweep time. It's reverse weep. Oh, did I, I get yes, yeah, right? I don't know. Yes, I do. What's going on here? Okay, it's not working. Well, new. Oh, wait, eggs. go back. I gotta. <laughs> um, that's the wrong one. Yeah, I think I think Lauren is the play. Yeah, you have to have it. But like you said, it now probably wasn't. To... It probably wasn't mattering in that game. But I yeah, get to, I get to lock in my my sideboard for this right now, though, which is kind of nice. Definitely want to go first. Yeah, it's gonna be a big uh, meta share at the U.S. Nationals. Oh yeah, that I'm not going to. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wish I could. I mean, even if I qualified anywhere, did I tell you it was? I bubbled ninth in that RTM. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. upset. That's so sad. <laughs> like one tiebreaker, man. Sorry, I'm just doing my sideboard in the list. So I yeah, you're fine. Just click it next. And time. I am. I I did add the runic reclamations. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I don't know if it's I don't know if it's ultimately worth it. Um, to make space for in the sideboard. Depends up your average turn, yeah. Okay. New lobby. Oh, click the button. Um, I forget my Norwin gloves. I'm gonna go second this game because I went first twice. Um, sure. But like I would normally choose second, but we should. I'll just see how it goes. I think going first is big for me. Yeah. I just think, because you have so many two blocks, I think I can high roll a hit. And, uh, oh. just pass. Uh, it's close, to be honest. I mean, it's not close, because I'm always swinging this, but... Can you give me more armor? Yeah. Are you swinging for seven uh, again? <laughs> <laughs> no. 
Yeah, I mean, you have a lot of good turn zero plays, because you could swing 14 or you could just find a Genesis. Yeah. Um... The thing is, too, like, the reason the matchup doesn't normally look this way is because no one else has, you know, an Aggro Viscerai in their locals winning the RTN. That's like, true. Like, they're not, they're um, gonna play ALS one... and not Genesis and, or not know which plan to do or whatever. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense. All right, I I think I'm gonna try. There's oh, there's an argument for both of these. I think I'm gonna guess you have another two block in your hand. Lucky me. No, that's okay. I think it was worth it. I pull armor turn one. Wow, I have a playable hand on turn one. Nice. That's crazy. I've never seen this before in my the life. The thing though is like, is like if I'm gonna if I'm gonna take three cards, I should probably just take them all. So you reroll another random hands. I don't know. The like turn zero, turn one dynamic. Is I mean, you took armor. Like that's worth it. Confusing. Uh, well, yeah. I mean, you lost an arsenal to do it, so maybe it's not. But yeah, I don't know. Yeah, but if you had the two block, I took two pieces of armor. I'll take that for an arsenal any day. Yeah, that's why I blocked um, with the bomb. Go hits. Oh, it's it's two more on hit. I I'm also never sure how aggro or how like much to block early either, you know? Yeah. Cause I could block one, I could block this out. That saves me one life, two life, three life. Yeah. I mean, if you block this, oh, no, two like life. if you, if you block this, you're blocking for six essentially. Yeah. That makes sense. And if I block Nebula, I'm blocking for five because just one on hit. Yeah. I don't know, but it's like, do I just take it all and swing with a good hand? I think I'm gonna do that. I think this is a good enough hand. And now I hate my life for taking... I guess it was like... What was it, 13? Let's see. How much am I taking here? 12? 12. 12. That's not my favorite. It's a three card twelve. To be honest. Yeah, it's not my favorite thing, but I think I actually think it's worth it. In this particular case, I think it is. Wow, I have a playable hand on turn three. This is crazy. <laughs> Never seen this happen this in my life. Box. Okay, getting spicy. I think this is a game where I'm going to try not drawing with Soraya. Okay. Well, in this case, you don't have the soul anyway. Yep. But I could have gotten another one and waited till I did with Soraya. But the other thing is that the ponder is really nice value here. You may search for another figment if you would like. I think I will. Oh, you know what? The play was get Soraya last. I always do this. I'm like, oh, get Soraya first. But no, I should. I can like try and bank on um, the second Herald. I think if you don't block the first, like you're really going to block the second kind of thing. Mm -hmm. uh, so you, you mean you, you, so you can awaken a different one and keep Soraya on the board, you mean? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, I see. But like at the same time, it's, I, I think it's close. That's. I mean, if you're not going to draw, but... then Sarai is the most useless angel. But yeah, if you want to draw, then. So I'm just going to um, keep this Sonata in my arsenal instead of playing it this turn. Because I have the resources to play this Amplify, um, I'm just going to put this in arsenal because I'm happy to have fine, this in arsenal. Actually. Um, but yeah, like for for example, if I had zero rune chance, then I would just play this I have in my to give me the rune chance that I need to make this turn work. This actually could be a turn where I block out. No, because you have, you don't have Gogan, do you? I do yeah, have a muff. muff. Yeah. Um, in that case, I think I just pitched to save. Um. 
to get the most value out of my Soraya. Whoops. <laughs> I just said I was going to pitch, and I didn't. I think this seems good, yeah. Oh, because it's seven. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is fine. I forgot it was seven. From Burden of Reckoning, yeah. Um... So I could take, actually no, no, on hit you get a rune chance. So this is like it's blocking for four. Essentially, um, yeah. Or I could take 12. No, that's too much. No, I'd take, um, I'd take three, then two, then four, nine. Take nine down to 11. I have to live a turn from you. Um, I think I'll take it. One of the weirdest things about this matchup is like, when is it worth it to save life? When is it worth it to eat it to the face to set up? Kind of yeah. I have not figured that out yet. Just here, I think. Okay, uh, Runic Reclamation is probably going to come in clutch here. Uh, it's actually close with the play is here. So in this case, Sonata is going to allow us to pay for the Amplify, even if... I think I just popped this for Zero sure. For five on my light of soul. Card cost me a hundred bucks, by the way. <laughs> Wait. Zero for five with like just... what 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 two thirds of your deck is yellow or something? Yeah. Unbelievable. I am cursed. That is a seven, however, that is acceptable because I buy it back. You have another one? Back. Oh, okay. I mean, I'm happy with this. I'm super happy with this. Yeah, I mean, I'm actually kind of happy too because you have less of a oh. turn here. Yeah. Actually, that's nice. That's turn, nice that, that... You, normally, you normally play four out of five and then Arsenal, right? Yeah, that's true. Um, so this is a normal turn. You just don't. But like that. not having an Arsenal matters a lot too. Um, but obviously it's worth it there. So, I'm just gonna open an out and pitch zero, for sure. Um, if we hit an attack, then yeah, we can no, just, just arsenal one of these play and play it. and pitch this Amplify instead. But when we miss, now there's the choice of, if I play this mob, tragic. Um, I'll have to use a tunic resource. Uh, this because it's a blue. If it was a red, that means you don't get anything right. If it was a red, I might do that. But because this is a blue, I'm just gonna play the lead the charge and hold my tunic resource. Yeah, my sonatas so haven't been hitting lead... either. Yeah, is lead the charge main deck? Yes. Did you do, bro? Bro, are you telling me you didn't watch the deck deck? Come on. I have not yet. Oh, I, oh I made a. Oh, one second. Yeah, you're good. Um, I made a mistake because this doesn't trigger Viscerai, which oh. is so. I actually play this. It's a, it's it's a hardly a different, but this is slightly better. Anyway, yeah, I'm offended, Josh. How could you? No, I'm kidding. I don't care at all. Let's see. Uh, yeah, Coming there's two, there's one four. blue and one yellow lead the charge main deck. It's just like tenth. Are you presenting the lethal on me? That's annoying. Why it's, you gotta do that, man? Yeah, yeah. It's a it's a tenth and eleventh copy of Moth, basically. Makes sense. Um, yeah, that was actually Isaac's idea. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense. Smart guy. Okay. He's a very smart dude. He's a very smart guy. What do here? What's my what's my follow up here? Um,
I'm like unironically considering cashing in Halo just to not die this turn. Because I think you're presenting exactly for it. Am I? What is this? Two rune chance and four. So th I'm doing three arcane and eight physical, yeah. Yeah. I think. I think it's worth it. See, the thing is, is I'm gambling on do you have a popper next hand? It's the thing if I do that. Yeah, and you, you know, you've only seen one so far. You have the benefit yeah, of knowing how many I run. I mean, you would have that benefit if you watched my video, but... <laughs> well, you just put the sentence in, right? <laughs> um, okay, so I think what I actually do here is flip on defense. Pitch that. Let Bolana take the hit. So I saved a fair amount of life by doing that. Uh, no AP. So this is a super minor difference, but I would probably, because it was a blue mob, I would block the Nebula Blade instead of the mob oh, on so you it. don't have one on next turn? Yep. Interesting. Easier to keep Herald to end, I guess. Yep. And also, because I play discounted attacks, if I have like an Amplify or a Drawn that costs two or three, that's really bad for me. I can't, it can be. Um, but yeah, if it's a yellow mob or red, then obviously not. Pierce Reality is a card. Good card. It's like I do. It is taking a risk because it's it has to sit on the field for two. It has to get like two attacks before it's like worth. And there is an argument that the upfront pressure is much better. So I don't. There's there's an argument for everything then. I don't think I'm blocking this. It's better to just keep a card in arsenal. This is my first card in soul. Unfortunately, I could. I should not use Halo for that. I got. Ooh. Let me get this and put that back on top. I think I swing another hero. Actually, that's a good question. So that's coming in for seven. You have seven equipment block left. Are you choosing what to tutor right now? No, I've, I've already put it on top. You put I chose Hero the Very Edition. Oh, you, you search for Rebirth and put... Or, yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So my question... So I can always flip an angel. I can flip an angel, swing four, arsenal, or I can swing seven, flip an angel. No arsenal. Huh. I, mean, I think it's just swing the angel, right? Because that means yeah, that, that seems I get, you get you have an arsenal and ward four. Yeah, I have more defensive leeway. Yeah, I think this is good. I'm just gonna take that. Yep, and then I pass. That in. Uh-oh. Okay. Coming in for... Two and four. Or uh, one and four. One and four. And I'm making two on the back, so you can pitch a blue efficiently. Fortunately, no blues. Oh. oh. No. Did you want to let that die to a rune chant? No, I meant to pitch to the rune chant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Instead, I, uh, instead, I did not do that. Yep. I love, um, love Tasha and everything. I think it's super clunky sometimes. This is fine to die to an angel. I like to take the angel and its full value.
Jordan's asking me how the games are going right now. <laughs> What'd you say? I said I'm embarrassing myself on camera. Hello. Oh. Hello. Everyone say hello to Mr. Jordan Long. Mr. 4 -0. The Jordan Long. The Jordan Long. Well. Um, let me, sh I can stream my screen for you. Yeah, yeah. Are you recording right now? Yeah. Yeah, we're one and two. I'm one and two right now. I lost two games and I won the last one and now this is game four. Okay, so I definitely want to pitch the first one. And one thing that I was saying is that most prisms will not have any experience in this matchup and they will not play certain things the way Josh is playing them, I think. Because Josh has played against us chuckle fucks like a hundred times. Too many times, but like, too many. <laughs> He's tired of it, bro. It's also very common. Well, I can't say that actually. It was very common for decks to sideboard incorrectly because they did not know that we were on the aggro viscerai right expected that we'd be on the turtle burst viscerai yep that's another benefit you have if you're a random person playing viscerai um at a big event yep oh man so, so you're coming judge to one then five you know what go away it's fine i'm fine Okay, I actually think the best course of action here is to take that. And just be about to perish. <laughs> this and is this fun, is, right? again, this like could happen. a super slight. I mean, it's actually not that slight. Oh, you flipped an angel or did you pitch to AB? Uh, I pitched to AB. I didn't have a figment. Yeah, so instead of pitching one resource to AB, you could have pitched one to footsteps and it saves you three life. Because I created three root oh, you broke two the root chain chains. in between. Uh, I guess uh, No, I never I broke the learn, chain. I need to learn your Yeah, I need to learn your chain break patterns is the thing. Yeah, I, I didn't break the chain because I went I went um Morgitide swarming that blade. And so you can you could pitch yeah, yeah. pitch the yellow to A B one and then footsteps one. And then you're blocking Nebula Blade, and I don't get these two rune chance. Yeah. Well, if you have a popper here, the game's over. But I think this is my, I think this is my best out because I need to strip cards here. Yeah. Damn it. Yeah, I think that's it. It's fucked up that you would do that, honestly. I don't know. <laughs> and, uh, imagine well, how does this go if I don't have a popper? Imagine popping. What do um, I do? You take nine, and then I present four with ward four on the board. I'm, I'm so I'm wondering presenting what... lethal by two. I strip some cards. I yeah, but if I block with, board. like, for example, if I block with grasp tunic and go to one and just play a five card hand, I feel like if I don't pop, it's true. In a lot of spots, I'm still winning. But when, when you're at two, my other option there, I don't, I don't actually know what other options I had there to be honest. I, th um, I think that was the best play. I guess I just play card. this. Yeah, I mean, I think you just killed me here, but we'll find out. Uh, <laughs> we'll tell you, Jordan. He uh, lost the game. To, what was it? Eleven to thirty-eight. So oh. You were at like five to thirty-two at one point, or or, or twenty-something at one point. Yeah. I and I said, and I said, he played two Genesis and he was at five with zero cards. And I was like, I'm getting flashbacks to the RTN. Yeah, that's cool. To when I lost to the Mythos Road to Nationals champion, Scott Koo in the All Swiss. Right. I, it was five to 30. I got him to five life. And then I didn't deal damage for the rest of the game. Hmm. Mm -hmm. But he was on, he was on full yeah, combo good. plan. He was playing Merciful Arclight. Yeah, that's fine because you beat him in the finals, right? Yeah, I met. Oops. <laughs> I met uh, Mythos Oops. Road Nationals Scott Koo in the finals, and then I fucked him up. Yeah. Get him. 
Um, you know why? Because I played more than zero games. Revel and Rune Bloods. <laughs> what was that? I said, you know why I beat him? So you're presenting Nebula Blades. Because I played more than zero Revel and Rune Bloods. Oh, yeah, yeah. And he played less than three Arclight Sentinels. We can't talk shit like this on recordings because people don't know us. <laughs> no, really we can. Them. No, I don't I think held, so. I, I held myself back no. earlier for the same reason. No. I'm like, mm, mm. Don't know you know, you, you, you know who deserves it? Talking shit. You know who deserves it? Scott. Scott Q. Mythos went a national champion. <laughs> Scott Q. He deserves, he deserves it more than anyone that I know. I'm not taking it back. <laughs> I hope he watches this. Y'all are so rude. So rude. Keep him on blast. I hope he watches. Um, that sucks. Um, I think you stripped my hand here, right? Not crazy. Yeah. Yeah, this is real bad. Real bad. This is really bad. Really stinky. I actually wonder if I sh Did I have paid in the fact? Or maybe I shouldn't have paid in the footsteps there. If... Maybe I just take the one go to one. Yeah, because if you let this Nebula Blade hit, then once again, like, you could have saved one extra damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it, it doesn't matter in the long run, this game, but that matters... Wait, no, I don't. ...in a vacuum. I don't actually want to do that. Cancel. Zero. Yeah, because I mean, I oh. should have kept footsteps for this attack. Yeah. But I mean, it doesn't. Uh, it doesn't matter if you have to block out anyway. Doesn't matter. I hate blocking over by two. <laughs> uh, this is awkward. Um. Uh... <laughs> no, this is fine. Uh, whiff, whiff. Yeah, oh. yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is good. This is great. I this, hate that. I hate that. This is so good. Watch this. Ah, two of them. Ooh, oh, okay. and he dies to. He has well, Halo. I mean, so maybe not. To... Yeah, you can't do that. What? Huh? <laughs> what happened? Oh. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm not gonna play it. Well, I'm not gonna play it first anyway. Do 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 do. I think I. We'll play this right now. Yeah, yeah. Well, no, you're you're right. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> you're right. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Draw the dark dimension <laughs> is bad, by the way. I know what you're looking at, and it's not. This is correct. I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you're thinking. It's not no, correct. no, Wait, no you don't know what I'm thinking. Oh, oh, what's that? Yeah, there's two of them. What? What's that? What is this? Oh, Hello. Geez. Hello. Do 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 do. do. You can't pitch well, back to Alice. Let's play this. We gotta make sure you know we oh. don't miss any triggers here. Yeah, Let's play that. That's a lot of rune chance. Yeah, see, like the cases where A B matters, end game is not very high. But it, also, I don't have a Genesis. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Groups. Like you, you stabilize that one game. And it mattered. See, this is how I expect the matchup to go. <laughs> but, yeah. but, if you had been playing Reaping Blade, it would have been so much worse. But better. It would have. It would have. It. Hold better on. or worse? What? I'm confused. If you, if you had, if you had played. No, wait. Uh huh. No, that that can't be right. Yep. Hold on. I'm with you. No, no. It, if you, if I'm you had played. If you had no, mm, I lost it. Sorry. Um, you choose first this game. I'll just, you just choose whatever uh, you like. Well, this is for all the beans. So this of course is for I all the beans. What's what's better for me? He's gonna swing seven seven once again. It's gonna piss me off. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be shit. Uh, oops. Um. Hmm. Okay. Finally, I, I roll a soul, but it's not a. Uh, I've I've missed on a f uh, five out of six of my light of soul triggers on this set, Jordan. You reveal the Genesis. 
Yeah, that. Yeah. Um. I mean, I just I think I have to. Do you it. should. I, yeah, I you should. You should. Come on. And then we we activate the ward oh. ability of Rapture that nobody knows about. Oh, I shouldn't have done that yet. Whoops. Why did you activate ward? I thought my. Just to. Uh, just... I just need to filter. Yeah, you should wait till after I block. Yeah, I thought my attack had resolved because I didn't see the little. Um. Well, balls. I would oh, have yeah. blocked. I don't want to block like this, but I would have done this because I don't know if you have another herald coming. I so I think I would block. Block three three. Yeah, I don't want to. Three wanna... two two or something. Well, I want to. I want to keep this three block. You but... can't let him have a hit. You know, no, no, I know, but I'm saying like not. Bef without him pitching to ward when he has two cards, he might just swing another herald, so I don't want to give him, like... I would normally want to block efficiently and save two these two cards. But knowing what he has, I want to keep this in my hand. I think <laughs> you should just Darn. block the swarming. Because this, this actually... It's it only... Like, it's all... correct to block with the swarming, I think. You think so? Well, the, here's the fun thing is that I yeah. I'm baiting in the fact that the other card in my hand is a war tune. Has Josh <laughs> has Josh been playing Arclight Sentinel? Have you guys decided no. if that's better or not? He hasn't no, been playing it. Genesis instead. I mean, I think it's worth just, trying, but it's I, I don't like it. Suspicious that Prism players will. Um, it's so easy to get baited into Arclight bad Sentinel. Arclights. Well. I'm suspicious they will more commonly run Arclight Sentinel into yeah. Viserai if they think that you're on the Turtle Burst list. And no! if that happens, then lead the charge is a very powerful card. <sighs> Jordan, why did you tell me to do that? After I cheated with the information that I had, I should have kept that swarming, dude. Uh, yeah, oh, hold on one second, actually. <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's, it's You're right. Um, Mordred tide. Yeah, no, I think it's worth. I think it's worth trying the Arclight Sentinel. I also think. I also think it's worth playing neither Genesis or Arclight. It might be worth trying it, but I don't yeah, know. Because my I my, think, like, I think that the best strategy vacuum, is just racing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In a in a vacuum, if you like, if Prism Prism plays Arclight Sentinel out, lead the charge is an incredibly powerful way yeah. to evade uh, that card and, and really punish them for playing it. Oh. I didn't have the cards in hand that I thought I had. I mean, That's okay. Is... Um... Hmm. Uh... No, 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 don't do it. <laughs> do not do it. The thing it. is, he just footsteps and swings a herald if I pop this, right? Do not pop it. Do not do it. I mean, I could play like a three card hand without this, but. You should. Yeah, that's. You think I should keep it? I think so. Yeah. I, I think so too. Well, I think so because if I pop it, he just. I mean, if he has a blue, I guess he could. He might not have a blue, but he could just pitch a blue to. You know, footsteps herald. It won't have go again, but or, I... or yellow with the war tune. Yeah, or yellow or with a war tune. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but if he had a war tune, he would have played it last turn. Well, that's not necessarily true. That's... I just yeah. drew four cards, my guy. <laughs> I don't know that that one. I mean, I mean a, a war tune in, in Arsenal, but this one of these could be whatever. Because I could just play like become discard this. Which is pretty mid. I don't think that you need to do that though. Yeah, no, this is fine. And I think that playing I'm just playing this out. Red mauve into red amplify on a runic reckoning is incredibly powerful. Dude, why would you tell him what we have, bro? Probably a mistake. All the all the words go in one ear out the other. Dude, I'm, now I'm he now he knows what to do with the rest of his turn because you said our cards out loud. Arc light this, arc light that. I'm going to draw <laughs> my entire deck this turn. <laughs> if only. Oh my god. Oh, I hate everything. Um... Mm. 
Yeah, this is a bad turn cycle. I thought if is I it had a war tune, <laughs> let's go. War tune, if I had a blue other than the war tune, I kept I keep four cards there, but I missed that the blue was also the war tune. Yeah, so he would have been able to pay for footsteps and still swing. Yep, you're so smart. It's cool. No wonder this guy went 4 0. We, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, it's fine. We have a 1 for 6, too. That's true. Yeah. Bang. Mm. I'm just going to put this in Arsenal. I think. Well, so I'm pitching one of these for fodder. I think this is fine. Pitch this one. Transform it, rather. Please stop. Yeah, just one second. Please make one less ring chant, thank you. Uh I will stop. Just let me just just pitch one more card after this. And then I will stop. Oh sure. Oh sure. Okay, so three, six, then theoretically Nebula Blade for two and four. For for one and four, unless this mob hits. Or unless I have a a card that I'm gonna I hate play. How how Talishar like leaves some of the rune chants on the field. Yeah, it's kind of it's visually a little confusing. One of them has resolved. Yeah. yeah. And this is also coming in for nine because of the runic reclamation or runic reckoning. Oh. Is it reclamation is the yep. three for seven? Right? Reclamation is the popper. I did so I didn't have them in the deck originally, and I'm I'm trying um, two right now. To see how it feels, and last game it mattered. It's good. It's a popper through Herald of Triumph. So or Halo as well. Strong. But not both. Yeah. Yep. Not both. <laughs> I think yeah. I think that if if you want to tech that, I think so far that it's worth it if you want to tech for this matchup. It's um, also just a very strong card. Yeah, it's not it's not bad on offense either. In some cases, I mean, I don't really want to pitch a card to swing one attack, but it's a two card seven, so that's mm -hmm. yeah. on rate. Mm. But yeah, it, in the past, when I had, I had three amplify, one reclamation, and two CNC. Is that right? Yeah. I was testing, I was adding the Reclamation and not the CNC. I just wasn't playing all the poppers against Prism. Mm -hmm. I I think that's, I don't want to play CNC against Prism because one, it's usually not a popper anyway. And two, like it breaks my hand a lot harder. Yeah. Um. But I do like this, I think the seven power poppers are more worth it. It's not as much of a brick. I mean, because it's also it's usually a popper. We're we're trying an experimental play here. It'll be it'll be interesting. I see non blocks. Get dissolved, stupid. I've been dissolved. Oh, oh. he dissolved me. That's, that's an arsenal if I've ever seen one. Okay. I mean this. So. I probably just I'm pitching this to swing the sword. I think, just playing this out. Okay, I do have to ask how relevant was the dissolve. Um, not super relevant. I th I think that it was a, a good play though, but I I have a good hand. I don't really know until the power yeah. results. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's true. Well, I'm there happy. Some things that could hurt. Very bad. The thing is, I might have four cards that I can't play, but I have four cards that I can play, so it didn't right. it didn't matter that much. Because I could just one, two, three. 
I could just play this, but I think it's better to pitch it to sword and do it like this. I guess. Yep, see this is kind of a brick, because if this is if this is any other attack, this is you know much better of a turn. A good four card hand, yeah. Well I mean this is i would have gotten only like plus three rune chance or something like that. But you could have played the Mordred Tide activated. Mm, no, you no. Could have. I could I could just go Mordred Mauve swing but that, that's less um value than just doing this but i keep a tuna counter that way i'm also presenting the on hit but like yeah this is fine all right i've learned well i'm gonna do the right sequencing did you oh you're gonna block the nebula blade yeah. Yeah, that's also, I don't want to block this one because footsteps dice, but yeah. Yep. Wait, what? It'll destroy footsteps. Uh, Fantasmal oh, footsteps. Six or more, yeah. It if it blocks six or more. Uh huh. With six or more power. Yep. This is the question. Maybe you get a bad ponder? I think I can play towards maybe you bricking. Yeah, I mean, chances are pretty high. Well, reasonable but i have a ponder token brick the arsenal that right, but is if you brick the arsenal, pretty then... low chance you can watch the video josh <laughs> i'll watch the video just, just kidding just kidding i mean i think i think that my deck is a pretty low chance but man ponders and light of soul well not... well the literally the only card that bricks in this deck is an arc knight shard or in this case a blue unmovable i'll put anything in arsenal so I basically can't brick. Um, I mean, obviously some cards are not as good as others, but I can't really brick unless it's a shard. It's fine. Which is like a good, a decent reason not to play that. I mean, this hand... Oh. This is fine. I don't know what you're... I mean, what it's... What are you about? It's, it's going to be awesome. Nah, watch this. I think watch I'm this. starting here. This is gonna be sweet. Do oh, I? One Whatever. Are we actually doing this? Is this what happened? This is really cringe, but I don't really want to start with this. No, no, but wouldn't you start with the other attack first? This one? Yeah. No, because it costs you. You could pitch and activate grasp. Yeah, yeah, but but then I would have. No, 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 no. Trust me. Two, one. Because there's a chance this is gonna be cheap if this hits. So I'd rather not. But if it hits, you say. Uh, no, I didn't say that. Sure. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I don't think I'm blocking this anyway. No, not of crackle. I don't care about that at all. Nah, it's three vanilla damage, bro. Hit me. You took arcane damage. Yes. Da -da 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 -da. It's it's more it's more fun to reveal the cards one at a time over the board. I'm not gonna lie. Go no. <laughs> I should have played the other one first. We're so bad. Random flips, bro. We're so bad. Hey man, I, like what I'm saying is like you could, if you play. Mm. 
Yeah, so, now you just swing. No, no, no. Now you, I mean, now you just swing. Yeah, but I arsenal the. Because it was runic reckoning and then mob skies. I think I would rather actually s cycle. You could flash in. The question is, do I play this to to put the um, reckoning in arsenal, or do I swing nebula blade and keep this? Uh, nebula blade. Maybe. I guess because I have an attack, I'd rather just be guaranteed to have an attack. You you know you have go again next turn. Yeah, if I because if I draw like, yeah. yeah, yeah, this is better. You won't have tunic, so I guess there's a chance that. But this is gonna hit. So, lucky me. Yeah, I mean, what the fuck. So yeah, I, I couldn't have known, but if I play if I play drawn first, then I actually hit on the tome, which is funny, but. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, this I mean, is. I knew that. That's obviously why I recommended that one. <laughs> you know, I should listen to you, man. I didn't go for uh, the pro tour. <laughs> You're such a bitch, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mention this. I forgot. I I wanted to mention it in the video. I want everyone to know this that. Jordan, who is the Viscerai guy that went for oh at the Pro Tour that everyone knows his name, he uh, he's not a Viscerai guy. He's been playing Viscerai for like three weeks. Oh yeah. This guy started playing the deck yeah. three weeks ago, and he just went four zero against like the best players in the world. Yeah, that was funny. <laughs> Fucking awesome, dude. It just makes it better that, like, it's not like I went and, and went 4 0 on a deck that I've been one tricking or something like that. No. You literally play, you've played it for three just, weeks. It's yeah. Deck. It's, yeah, the secret is that it's actually just good. Um, I don't like that. But I kind of want to. What if I just let it hit and then draw two cards? Well, I would draw, I draw a card. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I should just block with this. Nah. If I had tunic, I would block with this. Nah. Always. Uh, Do you get let, let it, it hit? Do you get let it hit? Oh, you let it hit for sure, dude. You draw a bomb <laughs> off the top. Or a, a Mordred Tide, I mean. <laughs> yeah, we let it hit. Come on. Yeah, That's the worst that could happen. That'd be fucking awesome. What is he, this is not go again, right? So he's gaining an arsenal off of this? Yeah. So, so like, he's getting one card and I'm getting one card. No, you're right. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Yep. This is better for us if we just let him draw. Damage him. already happened. The attacks he's already played. Yeah. If it had go again, it'd be different. Yep, that's good enough. Yep, I'm happy. Yeah, it's too bad we don't have. It's no, not. It's not. Matter, actually. It's not. It's, it's great. Totally fine. This is perfect. <laughs> There's no way for Josh to ever like know this, but letting the Nebula Blade hit on the last turn. The, the only reason that this turn functions. No. And it's as it strong hit. as it is. No, it doesn't matter. Because no, no, no. But I'm saying like because the Nebula Blade hit, you can play Runic Reckoning for free into Mob Skies, which triggers Viscerai, and then Drawn to the Dark Dimension is free, so you can pitch a single blue and play Rune Blade Incantation into Nebula Blade, and you still end the turn with an Arsenal. But if you don't have Nebula Blade here, and if no. Nebula Blade doesn't hit, no, that's not right. You, I'm going, look, I could play this. I play this, go to one rune chant. Play this, go to two rune chants. Then this is free. Oh, sure, sure. Yeah, so, yeah. I mean, because of the draw. Without the draw, then that's right. right. I would have to pitch the card that I draw. Um, without the balance of justice, if I didn't have a rune chant, I would have to pitch the card that this gains me. But that's also fine. Yeah. But yeah, that's that's right. the that's the impact right. that that's one awesome. rune chant has. Which is why, like, which is why I told him earlier, like, if it's a blue mauve and you have the option, block the nebula blade instead. Mm -hmm. um, the only yeah. thing is, if if you make that choice, you'll get punished. If I play a revel in rune blood. Oh wait, that was a mistake. I didn't want to do that. I don't think we need to do that. Either. I wanted to do it last, yeah. Actually, so I wanted to do this at the end to see what I draw, because for example, like I draw like a swarming gloom veil, and put yeah. and I want to put this in arsenal. I think that's correct the only the only argument is if i care about closing the chain but i don't think i do like because of footsteps if you don't want to close the chain then you have to play this first yeah and so like two rune chance here but i don't i don't care because this is attacking for six 
Josh only has one spectral shield on board, right? Two. Uh, three. 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 Okay, hold on. So. It's two rune chance, right? Actually, yeah, this is maybe just fine. Yeah, I, I don't think I care. If I click, I don't care about closing the chain on this turn, but otherwise I would have played this. Yeah. It's a very slight difference. But I'm going to draw a second Revelin Rune Blood. Yeah. <laughs> that would be crazy. Holy shit. Can you... Holy shit. <laughs> yes. Yeah, that's yes. really broken. <laughs> that's fucked up, honestly. It's the best blue in the deck. As I said. Yeah, da, 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 da. How about a zero for five in blue? This is thick, so this will be ten on this attack. Uh, eleven. And yeah. Four. In an additional, it's four and one. Yep. The on hit doesn't matter from Nebula Blade now. So you're presenting fifteen. Yes. Uh. Yep. Uh, yeah. On this chain link, yeah. So it was fifteen, and then it was eight on the first link. So. Okay, but I'm I'm facing 23 board, damage. I'm facing 15 damage, right? Yeah. 15 remaining. Yeah. So it's a five card, 23, and I end with an arsenal. Well, it was six cards, so yeah, it's a five card, 23, essentially. It's almost five value per card, and I'm keeping up creepers. That means if Josh takes this whole thing, we kill him with. Oh, are you blood. not? Are you flipping, erudition here for the health? Is that why you kept the not two floating? Oh, okay. <laughs> not for the health, my guy. Not for the <laughs> Call an ambulance. <laughs> but not for me. Uh, he's, he's oh gonna, shit! He's uh, gonna fuck you up. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. I'm gonna lose. He's gonna play a Genesis, and I'm never gonna deal damage. Yeah. Let's watch. Uh, there it is. <laughs> this hand is a little. Uh, we'll no, see. No, this hand is awesome. No, this is awesome. You're right. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> I can block with creepers. I should, in case he just like plays two auras or something. Dude, I can't even draw a card. What is this? Actually, am I gonna? Is there a world where I use that? Hold on one second. I don't think I blocked with that actually. It's gonna break, but it, I might actually be able to use it theoretically. Yeah, I shouldn't block with that actually. If I don't get to use it, then I lost one life, but it's fine. So, dang, he has a lot of cards. I mean, I have to, like, he's still going to swing another Herald anyway. Man, if you didn't have the popper, you were dead. Or if you had a sixth. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this game is actually so close. I almost die here. That's crazy.
That was just really lucky timing. You were able to keep so many cards. So this doesn't have go again, right? No. No. So I just have to be careful not to die to um, Ravages, but I'm pretty sure he's dead. If Sonata misses, yeah. I can just play this hand out. So I think it I just... doesn't matter if Sonata misses, it's not a big deal. Yeah, I think I just block with Creepers, because... Um, I... Yeah. Because, like, if, hypothetically, I could uh, use it. Well, if now this... This, this turn, because I swung with... Uh, because I swung with Protection first. Oh, it's so tragic. Yeah, you could you could have swung oh, with Triumph was, and then use Halo. Issue. That was... That was skill issue. I hate Dude, that. do I actually do I actually lose this game if you I swing Triumph? I think that you need to block. You definitely lose here. this game if you if I swing Triumph and you don't block, you hundred percent die. I mean, I don't because I had a Celestial Cataclysm in Arsenal and then I swing the second Herald. So I'd, if I I have to block it out to live. Yeah, you would have had to have preemptively blocked it out. And even then, I think I can Halo and still get the Soul to do it. Wow. Unbelievable oh, that I almost crazy. lose this. No. Um, yeah. Do you think I... So I'm going to three here. I don't think that you need to block with Creepers here. Yeah, no. Is it is it a guaranteed lethal yes, without Creepers? I'm not doing um, the math. Because if I draw a blue... One. I'm not doing the math. If I draw a blue on Sonata, then uh, like I could use Creepers. Drawn is... Yeah. And I'm not yeah. dying to Ravages I mean, at least, so it, it, yeah, it doesn't matter. But no, I'm also letting him flip here. Do, is, do, do I care about that? I could. You still might be losing this game. You need to do a lot of arcane damage because he doesn't have any spectral shield. Should I have blocked? Should I have blocked that out with with armor and a uh, three block? Uh, Yeah, what all? What all? I don't think so. Dude. Okay. I'm I'm actually losing. Wow. So I, I guess I, I have to kill Soraya. The problem is he has Halo, and so I don't have a 7 power anymore in the deck, even if I draw a Popper. I think it's just over. Wow, what a close game. I have to kill Soraya, right? Or can I... I'm thinking for like two and three. So I would take two cards from his hand and then he'd have Soraya. Like, I can't... I can't do that. But if, but if I kill him, he's having... If I kill Soraya, he has two extra cards in hand anyway. I don't know. Yeah, I'm not sure. Because I want to play the card in Arsenal. I think I'm just dying regardless of what you I choose. Play the card in Arsenal off the tunic counter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then swing the attack. Is that what you're thinking? Yeah, yeah. But then he has Soraya up. I don't think it matters because if I if I attack. I don't think that it will matter. I don't think that it will matter <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> uh. This is so tragic, man. Two, two, three. Yeah, yeah. two, two, three.
And he was able to live at one. I mean, it's just, it's not good enough. I don't think so. <laughs> no. Yeah, I think you're right. You have a choice here, though. I don't think we have any outs unless his hand is, like, truly I terrible. I don't like it. I don't like the choice is the problem. I mean, is there really any way I'm living here? I think the Keeping yes. Creepers... I think the Keeping Creepers was actually correct, though, because... It, we actually needed to present more damage. So if Sonata hits yeah. a blue, we could have we could have gone three yeah. links wide, but we just whiffed. I whiffed on like five Sonatas yeah. today as well, and he whiffed on so many Light of Souls. Yeah, it's not like one of us is just getting wrecked, it's both of us. Yeah. <laughs> Our earlier games were really weird too. Oh, I don't know. This is hard. This is hard. I actually need to get going, but um, thanks, Jordan. At some point, yeah. Yeah, thanks for hanging out, Jordan. Okay, see you guys. Goodbye. Bye, friend. Oh, this is so cursed. Uh... Oh. And I'm feeling lucky that your hand's cursed because this seems really doomed. I think I think I have to do this. I don't like it, but I think I have to. Let's see, the problem is I think I might have bricked my arsenal for the rest of the game. Oh, wow. Was like a blue aura or something? Because I'm like, no. It's, you know, it's, I told you, it's Celestial Cataclysm. Oh, right, right. I'm like right on the edge of the soul that I need to be able to do it. Yeah. <sighs> But the problem, I think... Can't you, can't you halo at the start of your turn or something? Yeah, I can. The question is, do I want to? Because then I don't really have a follow-up is the problem. Can you go like halo, cataclysm, I erudition could, or I something? I could block here. I could block here. I could pitch here. Stole that. Draw a card. Pcap. But then I can't draw cards off of Soraya because I'm out of soul. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. uh, I got I got baited by the Celestial Cataclysm Arsenal. It should have been a Herald of Erudition, but this is fine. Dang. I mean, it was close, though. I don't know. They, like, so I Because if I don't have exactly have Runic Reclamation. Work. I have two ways that could work. Do I have more than that? So close. Because I can flip and swing Ravages. Oh, I could just Soraya, and worst case scenario, I like flip and attack with second. That pulls a lot of cards, I think. Or at least all your equipment. But then see, but if I do that, I lock out my arsenal for the rest of the game. If I want to use my arsenal card, I have to take the ward on Soraya, because I only have one blocking card here. Hmm. Let's see. I think all but one of my figments are gone. One, two, three, four, five, six. So they're all in deck after just trying in bottoms. But it means it's bottom, so it's not there. Um, but I still have all of my blue. Yeah, I think I have to let it take Soraya. I think the chances of me just bricking on... Um, I can't take the risk to brick on those, I don't think. But I'm playing a different gamble this way. So, so. I think, like, I have to arsenal this. With Halo up, I can't try and block with it. Like, I can't rely on that anyway. So now I do have the choice. I could Halo. I mean, this card, game so hard, this hand man. doesn't block well. Like, Halo. Bop, bop, bop. like, I feel like I'm probably still losing, I but guess it's, the soul to swing it's unclear. I now I just have to see if you, because this play, if you drew a popper, I lose. 
the other play, I at least get seven damage before you draw the popper. Oh, wait. The other thing is, if I don't arsenal a card, it kind of telegraphs that I have a popper. No, this is just better. Unless it's because a sh it can at like, least lock out half your poppers. I think a shard. I think we do Halo. I think we put that into soul. <laughs> it was a passing mirage. I would have bricked. <laughs> Um. Oh wait, no, it wasn't a herald, so I don't. Uh, whatever. Whatever. If I get there. I get there. Yeah, I mean this is still really good. It's probably a. It's gonna be. It's gonna be really close. Is the problem? It's gonna be like unbelievably close. So next. I probably have to save my equipment block in case it's dominated. My hand doesn't block well, it's an issue. <laughs> so I need to keep I need to keep this in my hand in, just in case it's dominated. So I should block. Oh my god, that's so bad. <laughs> Oh, if you swing for, like, no way. All right, it's got to be one more card in her equipment, my friends. Dude. One more card, one equipment. I need to keep a card to pitch to this, and I don't think I'm going to be allowed to. Unless... It all comes down to this. How great oh, is that? this is unbelievable. I can't, like, I'm going to be forced to block out. So I guess I just have to play around Dominate. But if it's coming in for 7, then he's going to hit, get a soul, and get a free flip, and I'm just going to die to Ravages next turn. <sighs> this is so fucked up. So I just have to play around... Aha, I have won. So I can't... I... I have to just hope that he has... A herald for. Oh wait, I can't even block it anyway. Because if he if he hits with a herald, I just lose on the spot next turn. I literally have to play this. I think I'm just lose regardless, unless he like doesn't literally doesn't have a herald in his hand. Um. So I have to keep a card in my hand. I can't like play around dominate. And I can't stop a herald from hitting either. If he has a herald, I think I lose regardless. Cause if I block for, well, I guess unless I block the herald out actually, but it would have to be for five or six. So I can't play around, I can't afford to play around Dominate because... I don't want to block with this. I have to block out the next Herald. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so tragic. Like, I guess I'm just going to keep six block and go to one, I guess. 
because the other option because if i block if i do it differently like if i block with sonata instead of grasp here playing around dominate and then it's coming for six and i can only block five and he has more six powers than he does air additions so i mean it's it's cursed no matter what i do if he if he does anything that's not a herald then we're just saved but hopefully this is coming in for only six and then i can block it for six not die on the spot to ravages and then maybe find a way back in like draw a popper draw my third amplify is like my only all right show me the popper and you'll live no <laughs> Dude! Yes. Oh my gosh. I was literally just saying, like, oh, because oh, I have three two blocks in my hand, man. Yeah, so so the thing was, is that I could have led with this, but I didn't have another Herald to Halo. But if you didn't have the Popper, I did have an Angelic Wrath. So, yeah. like, starting with this was definitely the more guaranteed play, but I think I had to hedge my bets there. No, man. I mean, I'm going to lose anyway, but because I was thinking that, like, if I play around Dominate and you attack for six, then I can only block five. And so yeah. in instead I held on to six block. But, I mean, yeah, I was... you had to hope I had exactly a blue herald. Yeah. Either a blue herald or oh. any, like, six power herald, and then I can at least live, and then you don't have soul for Ravages next yeah. turn. But I mean, it's pretty cursed no matter what, and I'm not drawing yeah, from a, that point. I'm not drawing a popper next turn, so I lose. Yeah, let's see. Your popper was on to a lot of hands away. I guess away. you're. I, you're drawing into a C strike two turns from now as well. Well, you you don't soul. Probably you wouldn't have the soul. You don't soul. You, yeah. I have to hit you, and, and that yeah. So I guess. You. So I guess if you don't have a soul or an angel here, your next turn is just like War Tune Herald Dissolve Reality or something like that, right? No, because, I mean, yeah, if, if Herald didn't hit, right, or you had like one more life. Yeah, yeah. so if I block, let's say I block out here, I'm actually not dying next turn. Yeah. yeah. Like, what's your line of play? You're going like Herald Dissolve Passing or something like that? Yeah, I do. Well, I could. So Light of Soul would actually hit an extra soul. You would see the Sea um, Strike. Because you'd see the sea strike. Oh, then you could flip so, ravages and I die. Then I. Could oh no, flip you could flip ravages. it. I don't. I don't die to arcane, but you would flip it but and I swing. I couldn't attack with it, so I'd have, boom, boom, throw that into soul. You you I you'd attack for to... five and four at least. So you take my whole hand again. Yeah, but, I, but that would that would be my that would be my entire hand because I wouldn't have the herald in soul for, um, empyrean flip. So I'd have to go pitch one. Float one. Um, land the extra soul. Oh no, because I could play Passing Mirage. So I could pitch Passing Mirage. That would have... That would be a total of four. Two to flip, two to attack. Swing. So I'm attacking for five and four. And then the Ponder off of Dissolve Reality gets me War Tune Herald. But then I also have no yellow in the next hand. So yeah, you actually draw to four split. blues, which is really funny. Which is like yeah. my only out, and then if I have a playable hand, I'm probably winning. Well, no, I mean, so you have like no, you have no uh, yellows, but you're at least swinging for like seven or something. And so that's taking three cards from me, so I'm just losing. It, it's, yeah. it's, it's over regardless, but... Yeah, I can use all your equipment blocks, so I'm taking all your cards. Oh, that was tragic, man. It was close, though. So those fun games, it was, weird it was games. Cool that we had like two games where I felt solid, two games where you felt solid, and then like this one. Yeah, that was. Where it's like back and forth the whole time. Close. The matchup feels a little close and weird. Less one sided than I thought. Yeah. I think Genesis makes a huge difference. Genesis um, seems pretty good. I think I'm only running 33 Heralds um, because. I'm trying out a kind of heavier aura package. Mm -hmm. uh, not aura package, but like aura supporting cards. Um, so I think, I don't think I'll stay on it. I think 
I feel good enough into the Vestige matchups without like the two Tome of the End all that I'm trying out. Mm -hmm. um, and the play lines of those haven't fit. So I think I'd probably put in a couple more Yellow Heralds, which really smooths out some of what was happening. Yep. I think yeah. that Runic Reclamation I mean... is a good inclusion. If you want to fit space to hatch the Prism matchup, I think it's probably worth it. But, yeah, those were close games. Mm -hmm. Not very one-sided. Yeah, I mean, I think Nolan Gloves is definitely the play. Oh, I yeah. I mean, the, this game for me this is, game is lucky. This game is a perfect example of why you should play AB1. Yeah. I mean, I made, I made two misplays. First was sticking... Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. I was going to say, because like, this game went 40 minutes long. It would have gone 15 minutes long if you didn't have AB1. Oh, true. So or true. something like that, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I think... Well, it would have it would have ended earlier, except for those two misplays. I shouldn't have had either choice, Arsling, the Sea Cat, or the Herald of Erudition. And yep. looking back, that was a really easy choice. Um, yeah, and... Tell you. Yeah. <laughs> There's a turn you went um, Protection into Triumph. Was that last game? Yeah, it should have been... No, it was this game. It was like two turns ago. Yeah, um, because that turn, should, should that be try first. Been, it was. I'm pretty sure that turn would have been Herald of, or it was Archangel of Erudition. No. Yes. No. No. It was a different. It was a different angel. I think. Anyway, Angel Triumph into Celestial Cataclysm into Herald Protection. Yeah, I mean. I would have lost so I, I just I lost out I lost on the ability to see cat easily because of that line, but it's arguable that it was a mistake to even be there in the first place. Not arguable. It was a mistake. Almost worked out. You know what I need? Wage gold. What do you need? Wage gold. Wage gold. That's, that must be the answer. It's always the answer. <laughs> it's universal too. It's, it's a universal card. Right? Did you know this? That it triggers this, right? <laughs> it triggers this. You know that has this keyword called universal, so it creates a rune chant. It's uh, it's class, right? It's not talent, right? Yes, I universal think so. is. Yeah. Did you know that? Um, because uh, wage gold has this keyword called universal. That if you deal damage with a less than a lava, you can two to four to put on top of your deck. <laughs> wage gold. It's a cool card. That's. It's probably the most useless, complicated interaction I've ever heard. Well, I mean, for pop you can tutor for a popper. True. Very if you, true, very true. That's that actually just, yeah, that actually wager. matters. But same class, same class as Rubira. Yeah. If it were like same class and talent, bro, that would be in my deck a hundred percent. Yeah, that'd be Rubira. wild. Yeah. All right. Thanks for the game. Anyway, I think I got to get going. Yeah, that was I'm fun. I'm glad they were close enough that they will get uploaded. <laughs> yeah, it sucks that I didn't uh, win a little bit harder. People are gonna. Yeah, the matchup. It's not. Abilities. It's not super. It's not super like one-sided at all. It's definitely. It's it's really weird for me it's, to navigate. It's really it's hard. hard to decide when it's when it's worth to keep angels when I need a hand to do things. It's it's weird. Yeah, it's it's a hard matchup. Agreed. Well, thanks so much. I will catch you later. Yep, thanks, Joss. GG. Yeah, catch you around. See ya. Well, you played some games. I'm a little bit disappointed because I did think the matchup was favored, and I kind of do think it's I still think it is. But not as much as I thought. Maybe maybe it's closer to a 50-50, or maybe I made some mistakes. I'm not really sure. Maybe Runic Reclamation would have made a difference in my earlier games. I don't really remember. Um, but yeah, I also think that he played those games really, really well. So I hope that um, you learned something, regardless of how these games went. Um... I hope you enjoyed watching. Thanks to my friend Josh for playing Prism and Jordan for hanging out with us for a minute. It was a lot of fun. 
Um, I'm planning on doing some more of these. I'm, I have a few players lined up to play some other matchups. Um, so yeah, hopefully, hopefully I. <laughs> Hopefully I don't embarrass myself any harder next time. And uh, thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.